Okay. Ugh. So, starting a new playthrough on a new game. Well, not a new game. It's a very, very, very old game. Uh, I just beat Breath of the Wild, and I'm super in the mood to continue playing Zelda. So I decided to play my favorite Zelda game of all time, uh, Majora's Mask. Because uh, this game is just... It was so innovative and unique. It blew me away. Like, it absolutely blew me away. So... I decided I wanted to record it. Fortunately, I don't have a way of recording Nintendo 64 games outside of emulator. So I'm going to be playing this one on my PC. Um, and just to cover any legal reasons or legal things, like cause I think it's okay to play emulators as long as you own the game. So, you know, uh, there's my Nintendo 64 console for Majora's Mask. Never got rid of it. Never had the heart. Uh, but if that's not enough, I also own the Nintendo 3DS version of Majora's Mask, uh, because I love this game so much. And if that's not enough, I also, when I was young, <laughs> when I was young, and Game Crazy was still a thing, I managed to find the Legend of Zelda Collector's Edition, uh, just in the used games bin. Uh, and it has four different games on it. The original NES Legend of Zelda, Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link, the underrated Adventure of Link, it's actually a pretty good game. Uh, Ocarina of Time, and Majora's Mask. So I own three versions of this game. <laughs> so if, you know, if I needed any proof, there it is. Okay. Let me just, uh, I'm gonna bring up OBS real quick, which means that's gonna happen. Just to make sure I'm even centered in the camera. <laughs> All right. Yeah, recording off of uh, my PC using screen capture is very different for me. I'm used to recording off of a proper console, so yeah. Uh, this is my second attempt. Uh, the first one worked fine, but I stopped the recording because, like, I tried to... I tried to go out of full screen mode, and it, like, it, like, made the whole computer go wonky. I don't know why. So, this one, I'm keeping it in window, like, in windowed form. Uh, so that way, but unfortunately you'll still see the, the bottom status bar. But hopefully that'll help me to, like, if I need to access save states, I don't have to just memorize the keyboard shortcuts. Alright, anyway, to the game. This is my favorite Zelda, by the way. For replayability, for style, like, it was so unique, it was so interesting. This game blew me away as a kid. And I probably played it more than any other Zelda. In the land of Hyrule, there echoes a legend, a legend held dearly by the royal family that tells of a boy. A boy who, after battling evil and saving Hyrule, crept away from the land that had made him a legend. Oh yeah. Done with the battles he once waged across time, he embarked on a journey, a secret and personal journey. Oh, that's cool. A journey in search of a beloved and invaluable friend. Ooh, if only the... <laughs> Oh, if only Nintendo knew. A friend with whom he parted ways when he finally fulfilled his heroic destiny and took his place among legends. You see, I never had a problem with Navi, but I get why people hate Navi. I don't think Nintendo realized that banking everything on the fact that the audience is going to care about Navi... Like, that's the whole point of him even being out and about right now. As he's looking for his lost fairy friend. Who oh, honestly isn't even lost. Link saved the day, and Navi just fucked off. <laughs> like, Navi chose to leave. <laughs> I just want to say. <laughs> mm. Opponent's like, do you smell that? It smells foreboding and evil in this forest. <laughs> oh, tattletale. <laughs> <laughs> wow, just fully knocked him out. So, I will admit, when I was a kid... Ooh, the reveal. When I was a kid, I didn't put it together. That their names together meant Tattletale. <laughs> it's never occurred to me. I felt really stupid about it when I did realize. Alright, so I've been thinking about the voice I'm going to do for him. And I'm thinking I'm going to go classic Palpatine. Hee hee hee, you two fairies did great. I wonder if he has anything good on him. Huh, this guy, this fucking guy in the green. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. 
We've already knocked him out. How about I just stab him and call it a day? You, horse, are you looking for a new master? Kick, kick, kick. This guy, I think, is dead. Check for a wallet. Hmm, I need some spending cash. This is desert. This is a weird-looking wallet. Ooh, ooh, what a pretty ocarina. Hey, Skull Kid, <laughs> let me touch it. I want to see it. Phrasing. <laughs> you can't, Tail. What would we do if you dropped it and broke it, dumbass? No way you can't touch it. Aw, oh, but sis, why? Can't I try it out too? And Link's just like, ugh. The look on Link's face right here. The fuck did you just do? Uh, I don't got anything. I'm gonna kill you now. Ah! You motherfucker! Give me back my horse! That horse is my best friend! The only other friend I had was a fairy that left me for no reason. I now have abandonment issues. Oh, that would hurt my legs so much. That right there is why I don't wear shorts. Uh, <laughs> because it's a lot easier to just like s scrape up your leg like that. Being dragged by a horse through a magical forest. You know, it happens. It happens to all of us. Mm. All right, let's test out the Xbox controller. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Feels pretty good. Now one thing I have to very strongly remember, I have to not hit the uh, other analog stick because that's my C stick. So it doesn't actually do anything. So it doesn't rotate the camera. It'll let you go into first person mode. That's about it. Mm. But that's gonna be Nintendo and video games in general. Hadn't quite figured out. <laughs> Hadn't quite figured out 3D yet. They were working on it. Well, and here is where players immediately, if they played Ocarina of Time, they notice that now Link does flips. Now he's Anakin Skywalker. You will not take my horse from me. I see through the lies of the Skull Kid. Uh-oh. Ah! Holy shit, I'm still falling! <laughs> now I swear, there's a Metroid in here somewhere. <laughs> I could be wrong. Ah, damn it, I didn't see it. Oh, oh, it's a good thing terminal velocity is just a silly myth. <laughs> and he has spotlights. Yeah. <laughs> What's with that stupid horse of yours? It doesn't listen to a word that's said to it. <laughs> There's no point in riding a thing like that, so I ate it. I did you a favor. <laughs> it tasted like shit. Oh, boo. <laughs> Why the sad face? I just thought I'd have a little fun with you. Oh, come now. Do you really think you can beat me as I am now, fool? Ooh, I'm wobbling my face at you. Oh. Oh, my body feels weird. Oh, is this what is this what puberty is supposed to feel like? Oh my god. I skipped it last time because of time travel. Wait a minute. Everything's suddenly so calm and warm. I feel I feel I feel plants. Oh, oh shit, what the hell? Oh, what don't touch me there. No. No, you do not have my permission to touch me there. Oh, I have social anxiety. Leave me alone. Uh. <laughs> I'm just gonna say, as a person that does have social anxiety, that is kind of what it feels like. <laughs> like, Nintendo actually kind of nailed it right there. <laughs> Not that that's what they were going for, but... Oh my god, my face! My sexy, sexy face! Hee <laughs> hee. He. Now that's a good look for you. Hee <laughs> hee. You'll stay here looking that way forever. <laughs> It's not like you can just open this door and chase me. Oh, bully, bully, bully. Yeah, stay down, nerd. <laughs> I'm gonna kick you when you're down. Sis! Duh. Whoa! Whoa, Skull Kid, wait for me! I was just bullying little little boy green here. I'm still here. Uh, tail! You can't leave without me. Ow. 
<laughs> Not a ghost. You! You! You made me bully you, you son of a bitch! If I wasn't dealing with you, I wouldn't have gotten separated from my brother! Well, don't just sit there, Deku boy! Do something! Why are you looking at me like that? Like I'm the bad guy? You're the bad guy, you green piece of shit! Was there something stuck on my face? Will you stop staring at me? It's kind of creepy. Just open that door for me! What, I bet you... I, it's you son of a bitch. I bet if I wasn't just a glowing ball, you wouldn't be staring at me. Like, I bet if I look like Julie Roberts from Hook, then you would... Yeah, you son of a bitch. Open that door! Please, come on. A helpless little girl is asking you, so hurry up. Oh, Tail. I wonder if that child will be alright on his own. <laughs> and... Whee! I actually think it's much more fun to, to spin like this than it is to, uh... To just roll as normal Link. Whee! Ooh, hey. Hey, oh, not that money is a thing in this game. Money is actually kind of a joke in this game, and I'll show you why later. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da hey, wait for me! Don't leave me behind, I'm the boss! So, um, that stuff back there with us, you know, knocking you out and robbing you and stealing your best friend, and my boss eating your best friend, and then me pushing you down after you, we forced, you know, a transformation upon you, and completely destroyed your life forever, uh, so, uh, like, I guess I, uh, I don't know, uh, apologize, or fucking whatever, like, so just shut up and take me with you. <laughs> you want to know about that, uh, Skull Kid who just ran off, right? Well, I just so happen to have an idea of where he might be going. Take me with you and I'll help you out. Deal, fuckface. Please. I basically turned him into a Biff, but who, Biff who cusses. Good, so then it's settled, butthead. Now then, I'll be your partner. Or at least until we catch that Skull Kid, at which point I will betray you immediately. My name's Tattle, so uh, it's nice to meet you or I don't know, whatever. Now that we've got all that straightened out, can we stop messing around and get fucking moving? We got shit to do. If I figure something out, press up on the C-stick. Well, okay, up on the C. C up. Ugh. For me, it's a C-stick. And I'll tell you, I'll, let, I'll tell it to you. Hopefully you'll manage to get by without my help until then. Ugh. I don't even have, I don't even have digits, man. Ugh. Oh, were you gonna talk to me? Were you gonna talk to me? Fuck you. <laughs> oh, wrong button. Oh, no, oh, dual analog. There is no dual analog. Right. 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 <laughs> oh, shut the, all right. Hey, if I call you, press the, 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 press the button right away. I can tell you're uh, not very used to your Deku scrub body yet. All right, listen up. If you press A, blah, 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 launch into flowers. Oh, shit. Yes, I heard all of that. All right, good. Then you can also do a spin attack. That's what I've literally been doing since we started this. All right. <laughs> okay, you don't have to hold the button after you're in the uh, Deku button. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Wee. Oh yeah, Link figured out how to fly really fast. Like, it took Clark and Smallville like 10 years to figure out how to fly. <laughs> but he just turns into a Deku and is just like, I can fly now. He can fly, he can fly, he can fly, he can sing. Uh, now, one of the things I've always loved about Zelda is they have so much attention to detail. And so many little things that, if you didn't know, have, like, stories behind them. So, the tree we're about to cross. Ba-da-ba-ba, you got nuts. Yeah, those are actually a pretty good item. Although, you will completely forget they exist the further into the game you get. In fact, you won't even use them later in the game. <laughs> pretty much after you stop being Deku Link. So, where is he? Where is he? That tree right there has quite a story behind him. Hey, you! Oh, come on! Press Z and talk to me! Alright. There you go, dumbass! See? You can do it if you try. When I fly over to people or objects, use Z to look at them so you can talk to them and then fucking talk to me. Use Z targeting to talk to people even if they're far away. Or, if there's no one to target, you can look, use Z to just look straight ahead. 
But enough about that for now. I'll teach you about basic movement later. Get your ass over here. Oh, uh, yeah, this tree is the son of the royal, like, guy at the Deku Palace. Eh, who's just dead. That's a dead Deku, and it's really sad. It's strange, but the way you look right now sort of looks like this tree. It looks all dark and gloomy and dead and sad and shit. Almost like it could start crying any second now. How sad. One thing I was always bothered by in this game is that they never gave you the option to save the butler's son. Like, it felt like he was there, so give us the option. Uh, Tattle? Why is the world all twisty? God, I'm so happy to be playing this again. It's, like, I know this game very, very well. I'm sure there's a lot of little things I've forgotten, but overall, in a very general sense, I know this game pretty well. <laughs> Alright. Time to have one of the creepiest motherfuckers in Zelda. Stop me. Maybe I should make him Palpatine also. Nah. This is the famous line of the game, though. You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? <laughs> it's a fair reaction when he pops up. Probably happens to him a lot. I own the Happy Masks shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. Mm. During my travels, a very important mask was stolen from me by an imp in the woods. So here I am at a loss, and now I've found you, a Deku that I assume used to be a human. Now, don't think me rude, but I have been following you, wink, wink. For I know of a way to return you to your formal self. Oh, uh, he's so creepy. And he's menacing, too. Like, this guy, this guy was into some dark shit. If you can get back the precious item that was stolen from you, I will return you to normal. You mean Epona? Epona? <laughs> No, I mean the, I mean the flute, the, the, the ocarina, dumbass. Well, I understand why Tattle doesn't think much of you. In exchange, all I ask is that you also get back my precious mask that the imp stole from me. What? Is, is it not a simple task? Why, to someone like you, it should be by no means a difficult task. You stopped Ganondorf through time. Yes, I'm aware of all of this because I have magic powers and we never elaborate on them. Except, the one thing is, I'm a very busy fellow and I must leave this place in three days exactly. How grateful I would be if you could bring it back to me before my time here is up. But yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous courage. Wink, wink. I'm sure you'll find it right away. Well then, I am counting on you. Alright. Alright, alright, pedo man. See you later. Alright, now for one of the most addictive themes in the history of the universe. No, that wasn't it. Normally it's like do 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 do. Hmm. He gives me the creeps. That mass salesman was the Oh, sorry, just thinking aloud. But three days oh, there's the music. It's one of the most addictive things. Like it's just one of those songs that'll get in your head, and you won't even know why, but you'll be humming the song. But three days, even if we never sleep, that still leaves us with a measly 72 hours. Talk about demanding, fucking asshole. Well, don't just stand there. We're going to see the Great Fairy. Look, you want to find the Skull Kid, don't you? The Great Fairy will know what he's up to. She watches over everything, like Santa Claus, only not creepy. And just between you and me, the Skull Kid is no match for the Great Fairy, because she's like Santa Claus. Only hot. Go to the shrine near the north gate. You'll find the great fairy in there. All right. I will. I will Roger that. Um. Oh, hey, look. There's Kaffee or Cafe, coffee. 
I will go to the Great Fairy. But I've played this game before, so... I think her body should already just be out and about. And she's over here, the one piece that's missing from her. It's over here during the day. hey -o. Please hear my plea! The masked Skull Kid has broken me apart and scattered my pieces! Oh, it, it really hurt! Please find a way to return me to the Fairy Fountain in North Clock Town! Well, that was easy. Okay, <laughs> got the fairy. It's a lot harder to get at night. Wow, Caffy. Okay, I just noticed how fast time is going. Uh, I think the emulation is going a little too fast. Uh... I'm gonna have to fix that. Hang on. Uh... Ooh, hang on, before I do that. Make a save state. Alright, the emulation's going way too fast. Um... Alright. Resolution's fine. How do I slow down the, um, emulation? Hmm. Uh, uses pixel coverage for anti-aliasing... Not that that matters too much. If I raise the settings, so per pixel lighting, pixel coverage, theoretically it would just naturally slow down the um, emulation. Theoretically. Hmm. All right, frame buffer, let's see. No, I want the frame buffer. Uh, all right, let's see if that... Uh-oh. Oh, okay. I'm like, wait a minute. Uh-oh. <laughs> Did it freeze the game? Oh, that looks... Okay, no, that looks, that looks better. Although I don't... Time is still going pretty fast. Ooh, okay. So I think the emulation itself, because Caffey, Cafe, he was walking like a motherfucker. So that'll be a problem if time is always going that fast. Um, but they seem like they're juggling at a normal speed. They're not like super speed juggling. But Caffey was walking so effing fast. It was crazy. <laughs> God, there is so much to do in this town. This game was, like, way ahead of its time. <laughs> Just like with, um, other Zelda games. They could have done the exact same thing that they did in the previous game. And people probably would have loved it. But instead, they chose to be bold, and they changed up the formula entirely. Ah, Tingle. Tingle, you son of a bitch. What's this? Green clothes! White fairy! Sir, could you by chance be a forest fairy? Oh my! <laughs> my name is Tingle! I think I am the same as you, sir, a forest fairy! Alas, though I am already a 35! Yeah, that's how old I am. Ooh. No fairy has come to me yet! My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I'm a fairy! I tell you, Tingle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know, we should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange, I will sell you a map for deep as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Five rupees. Shit, yeah. I thought it was gonna be like 20. Yippee! You got a map of Clock Town. Now you can find your way around town. The red arrow on the map shows where you are, dumbass. <laughs> well, call again! Tingle, tingle, gululimpa! <laughs> These are the magic words that Tingle created himself. I'm a fairy! Alright, <laughs> good talk. Alright, let's just get a few extra.
extra rupees. There we go. I just made it. I just made back the money I spent in your map, weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, addictive. Oh, I already found the body part. <laughs> oh no, the great fairy! <laughs> How'd you know where to find her? It's like you metagamed. Man, Nintendo was bold to approve that design. I'm just saying, kids were playing this game. <laughs> And Tattle, Tattle, and you. I can't do that voice. Young one of the altered shape. Thank you for, for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. I am the great fairy of magic. I thought that mashed child was helping me and I grew careless. All I can offer you now is this. I shall grant you magic power. The power to blow bubbles. <laughs> How did Nintendo approve that design? <laughs> Nintendo is so, like, overly family-friendly. It's insane that they approved that design. Like, I'm still astonished by it. <laughs> I feel alive! You've been granted magic power in the form of bubble blasts. The man who lives in the observatory outside of town may know of the Skull Kid's whereabouts. But be careful, you must not underestimate that child's powers, kind young one. If ever you are returned to your former shape, come see me and I shall give you more help. Yeah, I didn't really know how to do her voice, so I just kind of... It kind of takes it out of me to do the, like, Oh, gee, hey, you're, you're... You're the fairy kid! Yeah, from the other dimension! I've heard about you! Alright. Time to blow mines. Pew! Yeah. Whoa! What the fuck? Are you the one who just popped that up there? Not bad for a Deku scrub. We bombers have a hideout that leads to the observatory outside town. You need a code to get in. Maybe I'll tell you what it is. Maybe I won't. You're you're weird. I don't like things that are different than me. But don't think you're getting it that easily. I can't just tell you what the code is. You'll have to pass my test first. <laughs> are you ready? <laughs> all right, line up, guys. If you can find all five of us by tomorrow morning, I'll teach you the code. Are you ready? Yeah. Woo. <laughs> Okay. Well, there's the kid over here. Oh, they're so fast. Okay. It's a good trick always to corner them. There you go. <laughs> now there's only four of us left. I don't think there were two in this area. No, there are. Okay. Fucker. They're so fast. Fuck. Fuck. Oh my god, I hate you. I hate you. I hate you so much. Yeah, you ain't getting past me. Oh my god, he was so far into the stupid thing! Alright, let's get him. Let's get that fucker. They're so fast. Uh. There you are. Woo! Fuck. Oh my god, I hate you, kid. Oh my god. Come on! There you go. You caught me! There's only three left now! Oh, fuck. Ah, <laughs> oh, the rupee despawned. Alright, Tattle, I don't need your bullshit. 
<laughs> you think you're the one guiding me? You're tagging along. Alright, give me back that root, that cucko! Yeah! Oh, you caught me before I even had a chance to land! There's only two left now. It's a good thing I happen to just already know where all these fuckers are. Whee! Oh, you, you jumped? Wow, I didn't think he could jump. Oh, you caught me! Now there's only one left! And look at that guard! Like, oh, you are not getting past me! No, you fucking don't! There is a way past him, but I don't remember how to do it. Like, as Deku Link, before you became an adult, if you can actually go out to Termina Field. And Termina Field has no monsters, because the game, you're not actually supposed to be out there yet. It's weird. It's not bad, it's just really weird. Alright, the last kid is over here. Oh, the one woman there who... When I was a kid, I thought she just knew that you were traveling through time. Uh, it was the only thing that made sense. But now I realize that Link is just stealing from the bank the whole game. Uh, because you give her money, and she gives you a stamp that basically has all the information on it. Like, here's how much money you have. So that way, every time you go to her and you show the stamp, it's like, that's how much money I have. You've confirmed it. It's like, oh, I must have. All right, here's your money. You're just stealing from the bank, which is awesome. All right, kid. No, you fucking don't. Oh, no way. You finally got me. Shit, man. <laughs> You're pretty good for a Deku scrub. <laughs> if only you were human, we could actually, you know, treat you like an equal. But you're not. Then I could give you an original bomber's notebook and make you a member. What do you guys think? No way, no scrubs, racist humans forever. I guess not. Once we let some kid who, who wasn't human join our gang and boy, did we ever regret it. He killed like three guys. Like, it was a thing. Our parents are not happy about it. Sorry, but I'll teach you the code. Uh, just like I promised. I can tell you only once though, so pay close attention. Are you ready? Two, two, four, one, three, five. I'll write that down just in case. Because it actually is a randomized code. It's not the same code every playthrough. Two, four, one, three, five. Oh, they didn't say the bombers thing. Oh well, whatever. Uh, uh, that way. Like uh, directions, directions. There's so much to do in this game. It's... I'm excited to do all of it. If you want to pass through here, you have to say the secret code. Uh, yes. Two. Okay. Four. Okay. One. Okay. Three. Okay. Five. Huh. Oh, holy shit. You, you must be a member then. Alright. Cool. There's a lot of cool stuff at that telescope guy's place. Oh yeah, and um, don't forget the Virgin Society Forever. <laughs> I won't forget, kid. Virgin Society Forever. Okay, now that I've gotten the bomber's notebook, let's... Oh, I haven't gotten the notebook. But let's save state that shit. Just in case. Hmm, okay. And I'm gonna give me some cookies. Ooh, almost the night of the first day. God, this this game really made me like look at time differently even as a kid. Night of the first day! Welcome to the world of tomorrow! Alright, what do you want? I know, I know this. Oh, I forget the voices. I know how the skulk, the astronomer knows the skull kid. Whoa, look at the time. You don't even have three days left. Get, get a fucking move on. Like, all right, calm down. Uh oh, I don't think I got enough speed. Oh, just barely. All right. There's one thing I remember about this distinctly. When I was a kid, that fucking spider right there just caught me off guard and slammed me on my ass. Now. Nope, that's not the button. Now. Okay, I don't have a shot. 
Hey, but it still hit him. Now you dead, bitch. Yeah, I grew up. I learned to look before I leave. You're one of the people that taught me that. So, thank you. Like, yeah, that Sculptula is one of the uh, creatures that taught me to kind of look before I leave. Blech. I love this game so much. Hmm. There's an important character that I'm not going to talk to right now. I'm not going to talk to him until I'm human. But, uh... He's important for getting a few pieces of heart. And even though you don't need to talk to him to do the thing, he teaches you a very important thing in this game. Hmm. Well, well! A strange-looking child has joined me today. Are you a new friend of the Bombers Gang? The Virgin Society? Hmm. Your manners seem much better than those of your mischievous friend from the other day. Herf, herf, herf. That ill-mannered troublemaker. Okay, this is more of a... This is more of a stereotypical old man. So I think I need to go for my old man voice. Alright, focus. The ill-mannered troublemaker from the other day said he'd break my instruments. Oh, that motherfucker. He said he'd steal my moons to here. There was no stopping him. I tried, but I couldn't find my walking stick, so I, he just kind of danced around me. Even now, just watch him. He's probably causing trouble around the clock tower, just jerking off on the moon. He's, he's that, that piece of shit, that troublesome motherfucker, that repskillion. Oof. You can actually observe some really cool things in this game if you know where to look. Like, uh, you can see the Deku scrub when you give him the land title, I remember you, you can see him flying, like, into that hole right there. Just little things like that. Alright, zoom. Yeah, I feel like somebody's watching me. Oh, look, there's a moon with a face. I'm sad because I haven't been in this game enough yet, even though I'm, like, prominently featured on the box art. Yeah, how's my ass taste, hero? Alright, Palpatine. Yeah, how does my ass taste, hero? <laughs> Woo! Did you find that troublemaker? And the loud noise, what was that? I thought it was my back going out. But the, where am I? Perhaps another moon steer has fallen nearby. You go through that door and take a look outside. I would, but I, I would never make it before I died. Oh. Oh, the burdens of old age. I wonder how that troublemaker got on top of the clock tower. It's not like he can fly or anything, or has evil magic powers and a demonic mask. The only way up there is through the clock door, and that opens only on the eve of the carnival. Oh, I'm gonna go back staring into my telescope because really I don't have anything else to do. This is kind of my existence here. <laughs> No, 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 no. You got the moon, steer. Its sparkling beauty radiates rather strangely. Like my dick. I don't think there's anything out here I can do right now until I'm an adult. Yeah, we got the... the gossip stone. Yep, yep, nothing. Okay. Ah, nice. The ability to rotate the camera. I miss it desperately. I will say Breath of the Wild had a pretty masterful camera. I, uh, it was smooth as butter. I, I think I'm a little spoiled on it after replaying the game. Oh yeah, time is definitely going by way too fast. I really need my ocarina. Otherwise it's going to be very, oh shit. Otherwise it's going to be very difficult for me to, um, <laughs> to play this game on emulator with the emulator going that fast. Alright, Tattle, you're fine. You're fine. Mm. Oh, right. So there really isn't a whole hell of a lot I can do right now. Until I'm human. So I might as well speed rush to being human. 
No, I'm not sure if you actually have to wait until the dawn of the... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Here, I'm going to fly in this flower. Wait, wait. Hang on. My good sir, this is my private property. <laughs> don't you, don't try using it when I'm not around. All right. I've already sold out of my wares and the carnival hasn't even begun. I'm thinking of closing up shop so I can buy a gift for my wife and return to her in my village. You know, this really does make uh, Link's wanton murder of them in uh, Ocarina of Time a little more revealing because they have a culture, they have a society, they have marriage, they have speech. And he was just kind of decimating them, so I'm, I don't know. I've heard that a stone called the Moon's Tear shines brighter than any other in the land. <laughs> yeah. If you've got one, I'd really like to get it from you. My wife would uh, love it. If you give it to me, I'll give you my spot here, Deku Flower included. Boop, 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 boop. Blah, blah. Holy shit! Oh my, that stone! You must have you must hand it over to me now! In exchange, I'll give you my spot here, Deku flower included, yes. Please don't use this uh, land deed for toilet paper, I, I beg of you. You really helped me out. Now I have the perfect souvenir for my wife. She hasn't set eyes on a jewel or strange sparkling stone like this in a very long time. The title deed for the spot should be in high demand among Deku scrubs, but you already know that. If you don't need it anymore, you can always sell it. Oh, I love him. I love him. I think you can get a piece of heart from him. But you have to be able to you have to be able to leave the town in order to do it. Shit. <laughs> that dog almost killed me. Um, I think you can get a piece of heart from him when you find his secret stash house. Ba 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 ba. Ah, pieces of heart. Takes me back. The door to the clock tower opens only once a year at midnight on the eve of the carnival. Everyone knows that dipshit. All right. Calm down. All right. What else can I do as a Deku scrub? I don't remember. Um. Like, on, like, I know plenty of things to do in this game, but when you're only a Deku scrub, I'm not sure if I do. I mean, I could always uh, give up the land deed right now. If the guy... I think the guy is always in the bathroom at night. And I don't actually need the land deed. Yeah, there he is. <laughs> you're giving a guy toilet paper. Paper, please! Uh, all right, here you go. Calm down. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Whoa! You saved me, dude. You don't even want to know the loaf that's coming out of me right now. Oh, Lord! There's a lot of blood in that. Oh, yeah! This fell down here, by the way. I'm going to give it to you. I didn't wash my hands. You got two pieces of heart. Yeah! All right. Nothing I can do in here right now. There's all, there's always bugs and fish in here. I remember that, which is useful because you actually need bugs and fish for a lot of little things in this game. I uh, don't think there's anything else I can do in here while I'm a Deku scrub. God, is the game actually gonna force me to wait until the third day? I think it might. Hmm. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Oh, Hmm. I don't have enough time to do the Deku game. If you get the high score all three days on the Deku game, you, um, you get a heart piece. Uh, I do remember that. And everything's closed right now. Oh, shit! Uh, I'll have to wait till I'm human. I didn't save the old woman. In uh, North Clocktown. Although I don't even know if I can do that as a Deku scrub. Hmm. 
You have to save the old woman from being robbed in North Clocktown at midnight on the first day. Hmm. And she gives you the bomb mask. I remember that. Oh, well. Again, not much I can do until I'm human. Hmm. But I'm definitely going to have to get that mask. Hmm. Like, honestly, there actually isn't a whole hell of a lot for me to do until I'm human. Like, I could talk to people. Uh, I don't think I could play most of these games until I'm human. I think you could do this one. It's the... Yeah, it's the treasure shop. Because you can do this one once each time as each transformation. Oh, what a cutie. What a little cute little customer. So you want to play? Okay, for you, it's only 10 rupees. All right. If you can make it all the way to the treasure chest and open it within the time limit, I'll give you a special prize. <laughs> wink, wink. Find out what Finding out what's inside is half the fun. Bum, bum. All right. Now, I'm going to say my strategy is usually hug the left as much as you can. But that doesn't always work. Oh, shit! First try, baby! With so much time to spare. You got more nuts that you will probably never use. <laughs> Damn. Alright. Woo. <laughs> Did you have fun? Can I have my 10 rupees back? No, thanks. I'm too bad. Come again. I want my fucking money back. That was bullshit. <laughs> that was a bullshit reward, lady. Alright, that's the couples game? Let me see. Honey and Darling Shop. You can't do shit in there until you're a human. Um, that's the shooting gallery, right? Shooting gallery. Can't do shit in there until you're human. Hmm. Hang on, let me go back. Like, most of the stuff you can't do until you're human. Talk to the mayor. Oh, damn it. 10 a.m.? Mm. You know, this is one of the very first games. Not the first game. But among the very first games that ever um, had a day-night cycle in it. Which at the time was pretty innovative. I think before this, one of the only games that had a day-night cycle that I can think of was Pokemon Silver? Was it silver or did, was it crystal that had the day-night cycle? I think it was silver. But it was it blew people's minds. <laughs> Welcome. Do you have some business? <laughs> the room on the left is the mayor's room. Sounds like they're having some kind of meeting, I think. The room on your right is the drawing room. It's also Madame Aroma's office. Well, the meeting they're having is one of those infinite meetings where everyone's just bitching at each other. You, c you can't break it up until you have the couple's mask. And then you get a piece of heart, I believe. Is that in the game? That's really cool. I don't think I noticed that when I was a kid. It almost sounds like this background noise of people bitching at each other. Most of the townsfolk already have taken shelter without waiting for the mayor's orders. The only ones left are public servants and committee members. Oh, I got a little cookie right there. Mr. Mayor and Carnival Committee members, please order those who remain to evacuate. Ah, hmm. uh, hmm, well. You cowards! Do you actually believe the moon will fall? Bullshit! Bullshit, I say! Show me the science! I, I see just a moon. It doesn't look any bigger. What a myth. What poppycock? The confused town folk simply caused a panic by believing this ridiculous, groundless theory. The soldiers couldn't prevent the panic, but outside the town walls is where the danger is. Monsters everywhere! 
You want answers? The answer is that the carnival should not be cancelled. I will never believe that the moon is falling, even as the moon falls on my face. Isn't that right, Mr. Mayor? Ah, hmm, well. Are you serious, Mudo? It seems that giant chunk of rock above us hasn't caught your eye. At this time every year, we are overrun by tourists, so why is the town empty, you fucking idiot? It's because the moon is about to fall and we're all gonna die. Clearly, it's your job to ensure the carnival's operation, but that's if people are here for it. Just look up! Don't drag the merchants and soldiers into this, just look up! Huh. Hmm. The soldiers wish to run. Then run, Viscan. We councilmen will stick to tradition. Wow. Those are Republicans if I've ever seen them. This carnival will be a success. I've never heard of a defense unit abandoning its town. Madame Aroma would surely say the same thing, wouldn't she, Mayor Dotor? Let's not bring my wife into this. All right. The infinite meeting will never break up until I have the couple's mask. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, the band manager of the Indiegogos, I believe. Are the fins damp lately? Oh, that's the greeting used among us, Zora. Where's your mama, Sonny? Huh, you came here by yourself? Well, aren't you a big boy? Why is everybody a creeper in this game? <laughs> oh dear! Oh dear! Are you a student of Deku Elementary? Where's your teacher? You shouldn't be here! Field trips go next door! Tell your teacher that! Get the fuck out! I'm gonna go and do uh, your son's bedroom. Alright. Can I read that? Cafe's Diary. The wedding ceremony is soon. It might be early, but I finished my wedding mask. I wonder if Anju has made hers. She tends to do things at the last minute, so probably not. There's a gathering of the fellows at the milk bar tonight. I'm gonna get wasted and we're gonna look at tits. I plan to show off my wedding mask and talk about my sweetheart as best I can. Oh, cafe. Fun fact, in the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask manga, Cafe and Anju actually have a much bigger role. They're even there, on the, the roof, while you're fighting uh, Majora's Mask. Or, Majora. Uh, Skull Kid. Like, they're up there with you as the world's about to come to an end. Like, they're, it's fascinating how much, like, a bigger of a role, how important they actually were in the grand scheme of everything. So yeah, the only thing for me to do right now is just to introduce myself to people. To remind myself of things that I might have forgotten. Hey, you aren't, uh, Andrew. I'm sorry, our rooms are filled. Get the fuck out. Alright. Calm down. Oh, the grandmother's in here, right? I think I need the... All night mask. Oh shit! That's right. She can fast forward time for me. Um, I can just go. I can just fast forward to becoming human. Uh, I'm gonna do that. You can't get the heart pieces from her until you have the all night mask. I remember that because it lets you stay awake during her stories. But she can fast forward time. Oh tortoise, did you finish helping father? Then let Mother read you a story. Now, which story would you like to hear? Uh, The Four Giants, please. The Four Giants, is it? This is quite a long... This is quite long, like I said to your grandfather on our wedding night. But it is a good story for you to hear, so I'll read it with some extra gusto. <laughs> the Four Giants. This tale's from long ago, when all the people weren't separated into four worlds like they are now. In those times, all the people lived together, and the four giants lived among them. On the day of the festival that celebrates the harvest, the giants spoke to the people. We have chosen to guard the people while we sleep. 100 steps north, south, east, and west. If you have need, call us in a loud voice by declaring something such as 
The mountain blizzard has trapped us. We are fucking freezing to death. Or the ocean is about to swallow us. We are fucking drowning to death. Your cry shall carry to us. And he fell asleep. <laughs> oh, are you awake? I guess that story was a little hard for Tortoise. That's also what I said to your grandpa. <laughs> but don't give up. Try again later. All right. Read me one more story. <laughs> it's been a long time since we had a picnic at Romani Ranch, hasn't it? Can you read me another story? Damn it. I guess you can. Okay, well, I fast forwarded to the final day. So that's awesome. Hang on. Doing math here real quick. Eleven. Okay. I can have one more cookie. <laughs> one more cookie. Alright. Bathroom guy I've already taken care of. So I fast forwarded as much time as I can. Apparently. So let's see if I can meet any last minute people. That's Andrew's room. Oh, she's in there crying right now over her wedding mask. That's not sneaking. What? There we go. That Goron is in there. Andrew. Oh, what a cute guest. Uh, do you have a reservation? Where's your mother? I'm sorry, we're totally booked with reservations. Please tell that to your mother. Oh, Andrew. Andrew, your story is one of the more interesting stories in this game. But also, when you overanalyze it, it's kind of creepy. <laughs> like, basically, at the end, she's just like, I I'm willing to fuck a child. This is okay. <laughs> I'm okay with this. When you really break down, like, the ending to her story. It's a little bit like, um, Star Trek The Next Generation. There was an episode where a transporter accident, of course, always a transporter accident, turns Picard, Guinan, Roe, and Keiko into kids. Uh, entertaining episode. But Miles is faced with the kind of quandary of, like, uh, yes, you're my wife, but you're also in the body of a child. So, like, we're not a thing right now. <laughs> like, she's, like, super offended by the fact that he's not into her. But at the same time, she should recognize that he's actually, like, a champion for not being into her. Because that means that he's a decent human being. He's not a creepy pedo man who's just like, yeah, I'm okay with you being a kid. <laughs> Ugh, so creepy. Mm. Way to go, Miles O'Brien. Well, Mwah. said that word. Yeah. Way to go, Miles O'Brien. You guys are badass. Mm. Honestly, there isn't a lot for me to do until. Until, uh. Until I go up there. Damn, he's fast. Once you become human, the game really opens up. But until then, I forgot how little you could actually do. You just have to wait. And that is not my strong suit. Hmm. I suppose I could, uh... I suppose I could just farm money from North Clocktown until uh, the carnival opens. Yeah. I'll do that. Because, <laughs> yeah, you can't do shit until you're human. Until you can leave Clocktown, until you can talk to people as, a, as an equal. Nobody sees a Deku shrub. As an equal. 
Yeah. But yeah, that little uh, patch of grass right there just keeps respawning over and over again. Might as well earn the money and then deposit it in the bank. No reason not to. There are things I do want to get. Um, pretty early on, actually. Um, um, I think you get the next upgrade to the wallet by depositing... Oh, I think it's 200 rupees. Maybe 500. Hmm. Yeah, they give you the bigger wallet for depositing a certain amount of money in the bank. And then, um... I want to be able to buy a bomb bag very early on. Having bombs is very important. For me, if I have bombs, then I basically have an infinite source of money. And I'll show you why. Hmm. Though, once you get light arrows, money is meaningless. Um, I'll also show you why when I get there, too. <laughs> but yeah, you get light arrows and money me no longer means anything in this game. <laughs> you need 5,000 rupees? You can get 5,000 rupees. Like, it's not the hard. <laughs> it's a little bit Breath of the Wild in that regard. Like, money kind of lost its meaning <laughs> once you got to a certain point in the game. Okay, so I've still got six game hours, which honestly, it's only going to be a couple of minutes. I'm a little worried that time goes a little too fast on the emulator. <laughs> I'm a little worried about that. Slowing down time will help, but ooh, I'm a little worried about that. We'll see how much it helps. <laughs> because every hour is going by pretty fast. Yeah, so once I get up to... Oh, I think a bomb bag is... its I'm pretty sure you can buy a bomb bag pretty early in the game. Ooh, but that's only if you let him steal shit. Okay. Hmm. You have to let him steal the bomb bag, though, in order to be able to... Wait, no, because they sell the bomb bag. Never mind. Never mind. You can still buy a bomb bag. I was thinking uh, you could only buy it from the Creepo shop. The guy who clearly just buys from... Stolen goods from people. The pawn shop, basically. Like, the most stereotypical pawn shop I've ever seen. <laughs> my mom, a long time ago, when my sister was still, uh... Oh, living with, uh, with her. Stole a bunch of my mom's stuff. Uh, jewelry, you know, like... You know, grown-up things, I guess. Um... And she sold it to a pawn shop. And then my mom had to fight with the pawn shop person trying to get it back. And it was like a whole thing. Uh, I don't remember the details or even really like how the resolution was. Like, or if, even if it had a resolution. I don't even know if my mom got the stuff back. It was so long ago. I don't remember. Alright. Go into the bank and gonna cheese the sister. Da, da. Well, hey there, little guy. Won't you deposit some rupees? My knees are on fire. I've been doing this for years. Nowadays, even if people have money, they don't deposit any. Nothing. Nothing. So for a limited time, I'll give you a special gift based on how much you deposit. For example, if you deposit 200 rupees, you'll get an item that holds a lot of rupees. I was right. Yes, I would like to deposit rupees, please. All right, so how much do you want to deposit? Um, 99. Wow, what a, what a really specific number. Not a hundred? All right, here you go. Seriously? That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot, a lot. So, little guy, what's your name? Roscoe. Hmm, Roscoe, is it? Got it. I won't forget your deposits. Let me stamp you with my special ink. Stab. Hey, relax. It doesn't leave any marks, and it's not going to hurt. There. Now I'll know you when I see you. All right, little guy. Now I've got a total of 99 rupees from you. Come back and deposit some after you save up a bunch. Oh, my knees are literally bleeding. I've been punching them for days. I don't know why I do this. It doesn't make sense. It's bananas. Yeah, so once I get a bomb bag, money is not really a problem in this game anymore. 
It's a little more time consuming than when you get light arrows. You just go up to a Kana Canyon and, uh. Oh, what are they called? What are they called? Uh, just kill some of those floating skulls that are on fire. Some of the Ghost Rider skulls. Every Ghost Rider skull you kill with a light arrow just gives you. Um. Just gives you 50 rupees. Like, every single one. I think it's like every single big enemy gives you 50 rupees when you kill them with a light arrow. Though I could be wrong about that. But, like, that's a lot. <laughs> In a game where 50 rupees is, like, usually how much it costs to buy, like, the, some of the big stuff, that's a lot. And they infinitely respawn in Akana Canyon. So, I mean, until you uh, clear the, the dungeon. So, that's a lot of rupees. That's a lot of cheddar cheese, yo. Oh, God, this is just bringing back so many memories. It makes me happy. Now, the beginning gets a little tedious just because I don't have the freedom to really do anything right now. <laughs> I'm making good money, though. I've almost already got the 200 rupees. In fact, that might be the, uh... Nine, eighteen, twenty-seven, thirty-six. I'm getting nine every time. That's nice. Alright, now let's see how fast the timer goes here. This is where you really get to see how fast the time goes. What a dangerous creation. <laughs> I would love a modern reimagining. 57, 56, 55, 54, 53, 52. Okay, that does go faster. I will say that time does go a bit faster. Uh, I'm just gonna farm rupees for a little bit because the closer I get to 200, the closer I get to the big, the big wallet. Which will just come in handy, actually. That's like a quality of life thing uh, down the road. And I, I, I do remember how to get the giant wallet. Um, the Skull House, uh, by the Great Bay. I think if you clear that one out, you get the Giant Wallet, and you also get the Mask of Truth, I believe. Alright. Okay, didn't miss anything. Alright, if I can get up to 99, that would actually be really cool. Because then I'll just need two rupees to, to get a giant, a big, to like, to get a, an adult's wallet. God, the music is so dramatic. It's actually very Babylon 5, the music. Like, the episode, the, the series finale, where, um, Sheridan is leaving Delenn. Like, this is that kind of music. Like, super dramatic. Ooh, that rupee count is... nice. <laughs> but yeah, the, the, the music is so somber and dramatic. Uh, it's so good. It's so good. Anybody who hasn't seen Babylon 5 BT dubs, you should watch it. It's... It's real good sci-fi. Now, if you're not into sci-fi, you will not like it. Um, and also, if you don't like, like, politics in anything, like, then you probably won't like it. But it is such a cool sci-fi show. Rich, interesting characters, fascinating world, uh, compelling, if not sometimes soap opera -y plot. Um, but so good. So, so effing good. Alright, I'm gonna say that's close enough. My year, my, yeah. Uh, I don't know what I was going to say right there. <laughs> Let's just turn in these rupees and then run to Clock Tower. Oh, once I become human, the whole game opens up. What's this? You need something on a day? Oh, I, you know, I've already, uh, we've already talked. I don't need to read your stuff again. <laughs> just take my money. Shut up and take my money. As I often say to Nintendo, shut up and take my damn money. Damn, you've got a lot of money already. All right, there you go. Don't die. The moon is real big in the sky. 
Oh yeah, yeah, the moon's falling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the moon is a falling. Uh, that is uh that is a big old moon. Alright, so before I go up there, let's just do another save state. Nothing wrong with being a little bit safe over sorry. Ooh. Uh-oh. Okay. I can still use this flower, right? Even though I got rid of the title deed. Oh, thank god. <laughs> that would have been funny. If it's like, oh, I'm dead. Alright. Cool beans. I, I, I guess I'm just gonna die. <laughs> when you're a human, you can just walk up there. You don't need the, the leaf. You motherfucker. You motherfucker. You can just fly. Alright, Vecna. Get down here. Hmm. Sis! Ah, oh, Tail! We've been looking for you too! Hey, Skull Kid! What if you gave that mask you're wearing back now? Hey, come on, are you listening? Dang. Swamp! Mountain! Ocean! Canyon! Hurry! The four who are there! Bring them here! <laughs> Slap! Don't speak out of line, you stupid fairy! No! What are you doing to my brother? Skull Kid, do you still think you're our friend after that? Well, what fucking ever. Even if they were to come now, they wouldn't be able to handle me. <laughs> Just look above you. Nothing's more mischievous than killing everyone. If it's something that can be stopped, then just try to stop it. <laughs> I'm so evil. Yeah. Ooh, you motherfucker. I'm gonna blow bubbles so hard into that moon. Oh, I've got this. Nope, that wasn't it. Boo! Poo! Ow! What the hell? <laughs> Did you just spit on me? Ooh. Doo -doo -doo -doo. You got the Ocarina of Time back. Princess Zelda gave you this precious instrument. Set it to the C button and use A on the four C buttons to play it. Uh, press B to stop. Suddenly, memories of Princess Zelda come rushing back to you. The only scene in a Legend of Zelda game that features Zelda. The only scene in this Legend of Zelda game that features Zelda in any way, shape, or form. You are already leaving this land of Hyrule, aren't you? I'm trying to sound like the uh, Breath of the Wild Zelda. <laughs> Even though it was only a short time, I feel like I've known you forever. I'll never forget the days we spend in Hyrule together. Literally days, because, uh, you know, we were around time, and I don't actually remember our adventures together. You, you said I dressed up as a boy, I did. And I believe in, my, in me heart that a day will come when I shall meet you again. Oh, diggity do, until that day comes, please take these tea and crumpets. Oh, and also my my ocarina, my ocarina, the legendary royal heirloom. I am praying, I am praying that your journey be a safe one. If something should happen to you, remember this song, God Save the Queen. This reminds me of us. Right a down, right a down. Air, diggery do. Now you try. <laughs> Link's lucky he didn't just time travel right there back to when he was a baby. <laughs> They're playing that song so willy nilly. You remember the song of time. This melody lingering on the edges of your mind is a song of memories of Princess Zelda. Ooh, are you taking a piss, Link? Are you having a laugh? The goddess of time is protecting you. If you play the song of time, she will aid you. <laughs> He's just been standing there having a brain blast. Snap out of it. What are you doing lost in memories? Get yourself together. We're going to fucking die. Getting that old ocarina back isn't going to help us. 
Somebody, anybody, goddess of time, help us, please! We need more time! Time, 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 time. Link's just like, what should I do? Time. Huh? When did you get that instrument? Weird. That actually, I think, actually think it's pretty cool that you get a different instrument for each uh, transformation. Oh, it's weird it being on the button, or on the stick. Save and return to the dawn of the first day. See, the manga is very different also. I think the, the ocarina just takes him back on its own. Um, Link does, it doesn't even occur to Link to, uh, to do it. Like the moon, they're just about to die. The moon's about to hit. He's given up. And then, you know, suddenly they're back in time. I gotta read the manga again. It was pretty good. Shorter, because it was only a one part. We're establishing the premise. You travel through time. Do -ba do do Dawn of the first day, Groundhog's Day. Or Groundhog Day. Hm. Whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened? Everything is... As... That fucking dog is still there. Uh... Uh... Link? Or Roscoe? Everything started over. Are you... Are you, like, magic? Did you do that? You can do that? I befriended the right person. You can travel through time? What are you, anyway? That song you played. That instrument. That instrument. Wait, that's it. Your instrument. Not your dick, but the, 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 the actual instrument. The mass salesman said that if you got it back, the precious thing that was stolen from you, not your dick, uh, he could return you to normal. Did you completely forget or what? Let's go get your dick back. And also, you know, like, your, 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 your digits and stuff. All your fleshy bits. Hey, Creepo. Oh, what was his voice? Were you able to recover your precious item from that imp? Oh, you, never without my permission. Never touch me. Oh, 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 you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Then listen to me. Please play this song that I am about to perform and remember it well. Left, right, down, left, right, down. <laughs> ah, the Song of Healing. Man, that gives you a lot of stuff in this game. <laughs> like, the Song of Healing is probably the most important song you have. No offense to the Song of Time. Oh. Oh, Bully Deku Scrub. I love that. They're friends. Bye. <laughs> See you later, alligator. Clunk, 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 clunk. Say what? Crazy, man. This is a melody that heals evil magic and troubled spirits, turning them into masks. I am sure it will be of assistance to you in the future. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, I give you this mask in commemoration of this crazy-ass day. Fear not, for the magic has been sealed inside the mask. When you wear it, you will transform into the shape you just were. When you remove it, you will return to normal. Da 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 da! You got the Deku mask. To keep as a memento, it literally transforms you. I would use that so often. I'd break into a place as the Deku, like draw them away while they chase me, and then he went that way. And then I would just walk back in and like rob the bank. Where the mask was seen to inhabit the body of a Deku. Now I have fulfilled my promise to you. So please give me that which you promised me. Don't tell me. My mask. <laughs> you did. Hang on, what's the, um. 
capture screenshot is F3. Okay. I want to start getting screenshots of, like, the creepo. Yeah, he gets a look on his face. You did get it back, didn't you? That's a screenshot. What have you done to me? If you leave my mask out there, something terrible will happen. <laughs> you don't even know. The mask that was stolen from me, it is called Majora's Mask. It is an incursed item from legend that is said to have been used by an ancient tribe in its hexing rituals. It is said that an evil and wicked power is bestowed upon the one who wears that mask, yes. According to legend, the troubles caused by Majora's Mask were so great. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's bad. The Ancient Ones, fearing such catastrophe, sealed the mask in shadow forever, preventing its misuse. That's good that they did that. But now, that tribe from the legend has vanished, so no one really knows the true nature of the mask's power. There is an interesting fan theory that, um... The Twilight from Twilight Princess. Um, that they're the ones, they're the ancient tribe that created Majora's Mask. The manga has a very different kind of like version of how the Majora's Mask got created, but it's it's not part of the actual manga. It's at the end of the book and it's like a short story slash just thing for fun. Like a what if. But um, there's a lot of fan theories supporting the fact that the Twilight created Majora's Mask. Because Midna's helmet has um, like the same eye that Majora's Mask has on it. So yeah, a lot of people thought that. I went to great lengths to get that legendary mask. When I finally had it, I could sense the doom of a dark omen brewing. It was that unwelcome feeling that makes your hair stand on end. You know, like like that, like that, every one of your ex-girlfriends. Yeah. <laughs> and now that imp has it. Oh, woe is me! I'm begging you! You must get that mask back quickly or something horrible will happen. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. You must do it. <laughs> wow. All right. Calm down there, bud. Really? You'll do it for me? I was certain you would tell me that. You are the hero, after all. You'll be fine. Surely you can do it. Believe in your strengths. Believe. Uh, all right. Good talk, bud. I can roll again. The world is different. That, that mask, the Skull Kid uses the power of the mask to do those terrible things. Well, whatever. Whatever it takes. We've got to do something about it. The swamp, mountains, ocean, and canyon that Tail was trying to tell us about. I bet he was referring to the four areas just outside of town. There's one in each compass direction, but what did you suppose he meant by the four who are there? I have no idea. He always says stupid shit like that. I guess we should just go and find out. If we go through that gate straight ahead, we'll be heading the, in the direction of the swamp. Hey, what are you doing pulling out that ocarina? Down a right, down a right. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm playing the song in reverse. Why are you doing that? No reason. Slow the time. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's much better. All right. I'm gonna finish getting that 200 rupees just so I can get the adult wallet because that's an important thing to have. Because then I can collect 101 more rupees. Oh, you have to watch it once. Okay. This is it's actually pretty horrifying. Like the transformation is very similar to the mask, the uh, Jim Carrey movie. It's like a horrifying transformation. So I think I only needed like, what, 14 rupees? Something like that. I, I got 86, so maybe I need 15 rupees. Yeah, because I think I had 99 in there before, then I put another 86. So that should be about 15 rupees, yeah. Or maybe 14, shit. <laughs> Meh. Damn you, damn you. All right, one more time. And then let's get me the bigger wallet. I have to remember to, uh... Ooh, maybe I shouldn't have slowed time just yet. Um, 
Because I want to get the bomb mask, but I really want to... I really want to head to the, um... Shit, okay, I'm gonna make time go normal again. Um... Yeah, the bomb mask is the big thing I want to do on the first night, but I want to... I want to head to the... I want to go to the swamp so that I can, uh... Get the song of soaring. Because that really makes the game even more opened up than it already is. Well, I forgot to go back. Hopefully this is enough. I want to deposit 14 rupees? Let me see. Shit, I was right. It was 15. Damn it. Alright, well I gotta come back. Alright. I'm one rupee short. Can you just... Damn it. Can you just make an exception? Alright. Well, I gotta be here on the night of the first day. If I want to do that. Like, that's the big thing. It's gotta be here on the night of the first day. After that, I can go straight to the swamp. I can slow down time. But there's a lot to do here. Like, a lot. But the sooner... The sooner I go to the swamp, the sooner I get the bow, which opens up a lot of stuff, too. Um, so, like, yeah, there's a lot of stuff I want to do. <laughs> God, this game has so many things to do, and I'm so excited about it. I love games with things to do. And I love also just knowing those things. Like, And this was back before the internet was, like, really publicly accessible. So, this is during a time when people had to just figure everything out. You couldn't just Google a problem when you had it. So we had to just figure this shit out. Like, everything. Every issue, every problem, every puzzle. And I managed to 100% this game even without knowing shit. What's this? You've already saved up 200 rupees? Well, little guy, here's your special gift. Take it! Ba-da-ba-ba! -ba. You got an adult wallet. This is for adults. So it holds a lot of money. Now you can carry 200 money. See, doesn't it hold more than your old one? Fill it up and bring it all to me in one deposit. Jazz hands. I love her. Okay. Now that I've got the adult wallet, um, I want to get that heart piece in North Clock Town. That'll be three heart pieces. Ooh, before it becomes nighttime. Before I fuck up. Let's get the, um, let's get the fairy. Because it's a, it's just more annoying to get the fairy at night than it is during the day. During the day, she's just right here. Now hear my plea! She doesn't know I've traveled through time. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, grab the fairy, because you gotta turn it in again as a human to get something good. Um, Alright, I want that heart piece. Oh, before I forget. Yeah, dog. You gonna attack me now? Ba -da -ba -ba. Ah, so classic. So fun. Everything about this game is just so much fun. Alright, there's a hard piece up there. Shit. I'm pretty sure you can make it. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, I'm pretty sure you can make it up there. Or do I have to be the Goron? You might have to be the Goron. Ow. I could swear I made it up here before. Oh, okay, okay. I think you just gotta really make sure you're walking in the middle. Which is not easy for the Nintendo 64. Oh, I was right there! Fuck! Greatest challenge in the game is managing the Nintendo 64 controller. Or, the controls. Too far, too far, too far. Fuck! I know you can get up there! I want that heart piece! <laughs> Oh, come on! It's right there! Motherfucker. Can you get up there as the Deku Shrub, maybe? 
And I just didn't try before? Let's see. Fuck. That is so annoying. I, I know you can do this. I've done it. I... <laughs> Fucking burn this city to the ground. Alright, fuck it. Doesn't matter. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. Uh. Alright, let's talk to the great fairy. <laughs> I don't give a shit. I know you can. I've done it. Oh, annoying. All right. <laughs> Inappropriate fairy! <laughs> oh, I love her. <laughs> oh, Tattle, and you, kind young one, thank you for returning my broken and shattered body. All I can do is ease your weariness. <laughs> oh, oh, I feel, I feel weird, I feel weird. Oh, oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. I did, uh... Oh, don't do that ever again. Oh, kind young one. Scattered throughout the four temples of this land are broken stray fairies like me. Please find a way to save them and return them to their fountains. Surely they will add to your strength. Allow me to grant you something good so that the stray fairies will not fear you. Ba-da-ba-ba. Your first real mask. I don't count the Deku mask. You'll know you're close to a fairy who's lost in a temple if the hair begins to shimmer. Come see me whenever your quest has made you weary. Oof. Alright. Easy mask to forget about. Um, because in your mind you might think, oh, I've already assembled her, so I don't need to assemble her again. Alright. Ooh, I'm probably not going to make it back here uh, on the second day. Or on the third day. Um, because I'll be in the swamp, so I'm not going to worry about the Deku game just now. I'll try this one more time. <laughs> it's just a slide. Ah, oh, it's right there. Oh. Ah. It's just a slide. Can't I backflip? Yeah. You can't backflip on the slide? I could get up to the lip. Too far, too far. If I can get close, all I have to do is turn around without sliding, and then I could backflip. <laughs> Fuck! I want that heart piece. Damn. Try that again. Okay, no, I'm giving up, giving up, giving up. It was a beautiful dream. It was a beautiful dream. That dream has left my heart. Uh, there's something I can do over here. Alright, so I just gotta stay in town until... Until, um... Until midnight. There we go. Nope, I'm trying to rotate the camera, not. Okay. Nope, that's really not what I'm trying to do. Nope, please go back up. Okay. Wee! Hidden treasure chest. I think it's money. I think it's money. Ba da ba ba! You got a silpy. Woo woo! One hundo! Yeah. Yeah. All right. Song healing. Can it do anything else? 
Oh, I know another mask I can get. Um, hang on. Yeah, I, I can get a mask. I think I can get a mask right now from the uh, mayor's office. All right, I'm not gonna talk to you. Are you the are the fins damp lately? That's just the greeting we say amongst us fish. Oh, forgive me. I am Toto, manager of the band the Indigogos. Or Indigos. No, Indigogos. I'm out of business cards, so uh, a Zora greeting will have to do. The Indigogos are the popular group that we Zora are so proud of. They've put a lot. They put out a lot of songs. They're like the Beatles of this world. Not that I know who the Beatles are. One of their hits is the Ballad of the Windfish, which is my favorite Zelda song. You know that song, don't you? Ba da ba, ba da ba, ba 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 ba. I love that song. You don't? There's a remix. I think it's called uh, the the OC remix. It's so good. It's like one of the best things I've ever heard Zelda wise. Huh? You don't really? Even one that famous? Hmm. You need to get out more. Uh, do you have a smartphone? Here, you can scan this QR code and it'll take you to our website. You'd be able to hear it if uh, the show wasn't canceled because the world's about to end. Such a shame. Oh dear, are you on a field trip? Or are you the expert person finder I, I hired? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, am I the expert person finder? Or am I the expert person finder? There's, there's a different meaning depending on how quickly you separate those words. Yes, 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 I say you have the face of a pro. The characteristics of the person I want you to find. Yes, yes, I know them. The person I want you to locate is my son, Cafe. You know him, don't you? You don't? Really? Don't all kids know each other? He disappeared about a month ago. It's terrible. I'm so very worried. I can't get food down my throat. I'd have lost five pounds. You haven't anything, though. Oh, dear. Well, could you look for him? Yeah. Oh my, of course, you are an expert. Well, I'm counting on you. Ba-da-ba-ba. Here's a creepy faceless uh, representation of my son that you can carry around. <laughs> Wear this to inquire about Cafe. All right. There's no reason for me to continue Cafe's quest right now because there are things I can't do to complete it. Um, I need to be able to get to Econa Canyon to, to complete his mission, and I can't do that yet. So, there's no reason as of right now. Um, do I need anything again at the bombers? I don't think I need the moons tier right now, so I don't think I need anything from the bombers. Outside of the bombers notebook. Um, but I don't think I care. <laughs> Alright. I would do the game, but... But, um, you don't get the heart piece unless you do it all three nights, and I'm not going to be in town all three nights. So I'm not going to worry about that right now. I can do the treasure chest game. Alright, let's make a save state, in case I fuck up. <laughs> I, can just, I can just start over without having to, to spend more money. Not that money's a thing, but like, yeah, I'll do it. I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> like I give a shit. Bum 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 bum. All right, I'm gonna hug the left. Nope. She immediately denied my left strategy. Damn. 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 Are the fins damp lately? Shit. <laughs> fuck. All right, fuck my strategy. Ah! Uh, oh, we got this. We got this. We fucking got this. Nothing will... Damn it. Nothing will stop me from my destiny. And... Load state. Okay. Ooh, that was a scary load state. I'm like, oh, did I just crash the game? <laughs> Uh, for you, it's 20 rupees. Yeah, sure. If you can make it all the way to the treasure chest and open it within the time limit, I'll give you a special prize. Alright. Let's try that shit again. <laughs> is it in the same spot? It might not be. It's not. Okay, so it is randomized. 
That's neat. So I'll continue with my left. Left to win. Nope. Farts. Farts and butts. Done. <laughs> and I saved myself 20 rupees. For 50? Alright. So a net gain of 30. Can I have my 20 back? Did you have fun? Won't you try again? Nah, I'm good. You think you're cuter than you really are. Um, I know, but I know that because you really treat all your customers differently. Uh, she does not really... She treats the Zora version of you very differently than she treats all three other versions. And that is the sign of a sexist. <laughs> that is the sign of a woman who only sees that D and cares for nothing else. All right, anything else I can do here during the day right now? Given the fact that I'm gonna leave and not come back to town, probably for the rest of this cycle. And there's plenty to do, but specifically for this cycle, I don't think there's much I'm going to do. Not in town. Because the postman is mainly for Cafe's quest. The swordsman, I don't think actually gives you anything. Um, I think he just teaches you how to fight, but if you already know how to fight, then it's not an issue. Um, you're the bomb shop, but I need to wait until I, until you guys get the bomb bag, which is tomorrow morning. This one is, which one is this? Is this the uh, creepy pawn shop? Trading post? No, I don't think that's the creepy pawn shop. I think you're the creepy pawn shop. Curiosity shop. So the trading post just has stuff. Let's see what they have. Hylian shield. No, that's not a Hylian shield. No, it's just the same shield I have right now. Uh, arrows, fairy, a stick. Uh, it's funny. They, they're like, you can buy potions and we have bottles right here, but you need your own bottle. That has no point. You can't, I can't buy anything because I don't have a bottle or a bow. All right, I'm gonna deposit my money with you. You need something? Yeah, I wanna deposit money. How'd you get 131 rupees so fast? Last time I saw you, you had zero. That was like five minutes ago. Yeah, I'd like to deposit 131 rupees, please. Damn! D-d-d-damn! I think you can get a heart piece from her. But you have to deposit like a crazy number. It's like 5,000 or something. Like it's a big number. I know they're a mission, but I can't do their mission yet. Um, the bomber kid doesn't matter. Uh, what's this place, the lottery? You know, even as a kid, I never did anything with the lottery shop, never. It's like the one thing in this game that I just never touch. It never mattered. It, it always felt kind of like, like, bleh, like whatever. Ooh, there's another chest? I don't remember another chest. What's up, dog? How do I get that chest? Or no, that's the same chest. It doesn't take the chest off the map. That's interesting. Yeah, that's the chest where I got the, uh, the hundo from. I think. Or it's a different chest. Oh, it is a different chest. How do you get up there? Hmm. Probably need the hook shot. Yeah, I don't remember how to get up there. Hook shot would do it. All right, let's just wait to uh, save the old woman. With vengeance in my heart. And heroic bolstered resolve. Ooh, it'll give me an excuse to, uh... Oh, I see you back there. Creepo. All right, can I, can I get up? I can get up there this way, motherfucker. Motherfucker. 
trying to walk up the slide like a dumbass. Son of a... Son of a fuck. <laughs> Alright. Son of a fuck. <laughs> now don't I feel dumb. Alright. Well, Creepo's just gonna be watching. Jerking off his dick. Watching everybody walk by and... He's just staring at a kid, basically, right now. In the middle of the night. So that, that's like a next-level creepy man. So I gotta be ready to kick his ass. Oof. The game in there is fun. You have to, um... Collect rupees as a Deku shrub. And if you get the high score each night, like, they freak out. They're like, oh my god, you're the greatest Deku that's ever lived! And then, if you get it all three nights, they give you a heart piece. And they just beg you, like, please never come back. Please stop taking everything away from us. A lot of people in this game do that. The beavers. Uh, the beavers that you have to race as a Zora to get the bottle. And then the heart piece. If you keep beating them over and over again, they're like, we're not worthy. Please, please stop coming here. Don't bother us anymore. How do I defend? Okay. Remembering how to play. See, I like that this Link, unlike the Ocarina of Time Link, I always hated that if he had the big shield, all he could do was crouch into a turtle shell. Like, this this Link, he has a big shield, but he holds it like an adult. Like, I don't know. It's just, it always bothered me. I, th I always thought it was weird that he, uh, he turtled. Old woman should be walking through here any second now. I don't remember her name, so I'm just going to keep calling her old woman. <laughs> I really just don't remember her name. Cool. Anybody who's... Hey, there she is. Anybody who's played the Nintendo 64 is used to that sound. <laughs> oh, look at her. So, so happy. Link's just standing there like, doo doo doo. I'm not creepy. I'm not creepy. Jacking your shit. Oh, watch out. Stop, thief. Give the old lady your luggage back. All right, we're doing this. This. Go. Get the fuck out of here. This city's under my protection. My protection. Guard. Doing a real, you're doing a real great job there, guard. Oh, you're gonna stop me? Fucking idiot. And thank you. Since he didn't make off with them, I can finally stock bomb bags at our shop. Maybe I'll put them out tomorrow. Yes, I must thank you. It's a dangerous mask. But maybe you could use it to throw your own festival fireworks show. Here's a mask that literally turns your face into a bomb. <laughs> you got the blast mask. Wear it with C. You can have a blast with B, but you'll lose life in the you'll lose life energy in the process. Well, thanks for helping me. Enjoy that incredibly dangerous item that I just gave to a child. Take care. <laughs> like, she's insane. Here's a here's an explosive mask. You'll die for it. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Are you gonna let me out of here? No? How about now? <laughs> Alright, I need the bow to be able to join the bombers as a human. I could probably do it as a Deku shrub and then um, just turn back into a human, but eh. Doesn't really matter. So now the only thing I'm really waiting for is morning because I want a bomb bag really bad like being able to carry bombs is not an insignificant thing damn it <laughs> I missed every sword swing I suck so much it's so much easier to do that as a Deku okay so I got the bomb mask I get the bomb bag, and then I'll probably head straight to to the swamp. You gotta save one of the witches in the swamp. God, I tr I tried walking up this. 
Damn it, I feel so stupid. It was, it was just right there. I I know for a fact, 100% fact, that I've done it by just walking up the slide before. I'm certain I have. I remember doing it, so... Hmm, that's misleading. Alright, so I have the Great Fairy Mask, Cafe's Mask, and the Blast Mask. So I've already gotten three masks. It's not bad. It's a good start. I need a lot of the big items, though, to be able to get all the big stuff. Like, I need the bow. I need... I, I definitely need the hook shot. Damn it. Um... I need the, the Lens of Truth. I definitely need the Lens of Truth. There's a few masks I can think of off the top of my head that require the Lens of Truth. Um, and that's up in Goron Village. Whatever it's called. All right. I'm not going to talk to him because I want time to go forward. I don't think there's anything for me to do here at night as I currently am. Hmm, let's see. I think this guy needs the Song of Storms. Let's see. La la la, they said I was much too loud when I practiced in my room. They got mad, sigh, now I'm sad. I'll just think about the past to keep my mind off the bad. Ah, uh, yes, I'll do that. Dear guest, long ago I was in an animal troop with dogs and donkeys and such. Why coulda, why coulda, why coulda man join? <sighs> That's cause a man is an animal too, my boy. They were all great, but there was one thing I didn't like about it. Why was the, why was the, why was the dog the leader? Was it cause something was wrong with me, sir? It looks like he's really ferociously jerking off right there. Oh, that dog was an amazing leader. He always had a stellar troop, no matter what animals he had to work with. That's why I, that's why I, that's why I stole it. The dog's mask, I stole it. I wanted it because it was the leader's mask. But I no longer need it. I give it to my guest. Oh, okay. I got the Bremen mask. Uh, I think that does one thing in this actual game. Um, literally one thing. Um, this mask belonged to the leader of the animal troop. Try parading it around tiny young animals. The leader was a good instructor. His members matured quickly and they became adults in an instant. Which is a terrible thing to wish upon anybody. Like, adulthood is awful. <laughs> Everybody should, like, cherish your childhood. Because once it's gone, it's gone, man. Alright, so that was a... a I thought you needed, the, like, the Song of Storms to get that mask. Alright, neat. <laughs> so that's four masks I've gotten so far. Out of 24? Something like that. So I'm, oh, I might as well get some money from the bank. I'm gonna be buying a bomb bag, baby. Oh, baby. Ma'am, I'd like to uh, withdraw some money, please. I can't imagine it would cost more than 100 rupees. You're really taking out that much? Damn, dude. You're crazy. You keep spending it like that, it's, just, it's all gonna be gone. <laughs> I remember them. They were like, leave us the fuck alone. Don't bother us. Don't bother us. And this guard, he's just like, I have the best job in the world. <laughs> oh, hey, looking at that. That really is the uh, the guard armor. Uh, the Breath of the Wild, They, you can get that armor. Neat. Nice touch. Nice attention to detail. All right, what time does the uh, bomb shop open? Hopefully six, but probably not till like 10. Yeah, this game actually uses moderate logic. So like, Things open at specific times, and times that actually make sense. Alright, dawn of the second day. Dun dun dun! Hey! They open at six. Nice. Do you have a bomb bag? 
Welcome. Uh. Hey, you do have a bomb bag. 90 rupees. This can hold up to 30 bombs. We just got it in stock. Yes, please. Da 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 da. I could care less about the bomb shoes. They're like, you like never use them in this game. <laughs> Thank you very much. We just got a larger bomb bag in stock. Oh, you did. No, wait, no, that's the same bomb bag. You trying to fucking, you trying to fucking rob me, dude? Please tell me they included bombs. They did. They just gave a child 30 bombs. <laughs> There's something wrong here. <laughs> Alright, well now that I got bombs... Now that I got bombs, I think I'm... Yeah, I think I'll slow down time. And then I'll head to the swamp. Where I can get my first bottle. Um... Where I can... Well, you get the bottle, then once you, you can get the bow in the swamp, but that's actually in the, um... That's actually in the temple. Uh... I'm in E... I'm in the west side, right? Yeah. Oh, stop right there! Have you an errand at the ocean? It's dangerous outside the town walls, so I cannot allow a child like you to... A sword? My apologies, sir. I was... It was wrong of me to treat you like a child. At Great Bay, you can see clear to the ocean. It lies this way. Be careful. Alright, thank you, fellow adult. Finally, somebody that recognizes class. Uh-oh. <laughs> the emulator didn't like that. Ah, Termina Field is very cool. A lot of, lot of interesting little uh, tidbits in Termina Field. I don't care about him. Uh, I don't think there's anything down that particular one I need. Um, there's something down here I want to do. I want to show off how I basically get infinite rupees. Not infinite, but like, ass tons of rupees. So that guy right there is the key to ass tons of rupees. When you're a kid, it's best just to use bombs to kill him. I think it takes like six bombs. Nope, wrong button. Well, it's, it's worth it. You just find bombs in the grass. But he drops a fitty. There you go. Dead. <laughs> Look at that. Fitty, right there. I never cared about that. Like, it never really dropped enough money to be worth it. So that's 50 just right there, and he respawns uh, as long as it's daytime. Um, but then down here, there's two more. So that's 150 easy rupees just... Uh-oh. I hit the wrong button. Uh-oh. Yeah, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. Oh. Oh, don't turn around. Oh, don't turn around. Man, I might run. Hey. <laughs> oh, boy. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. My link is tired. You have to get really close to it, get the lock on. Or just do it without the lock on. Alright, there you go. A hundred rupees from down there, fifty from up there. It's a good early source of money, is just to kill them with bombs. And I don't remember what this is, a heart piece? If it is, then I've got another heart container. Yes! <laughs> totally worth it. So I was gonna come down there no matter what. I don't think these ones respawn, the ones down here, but I think the one up here does respawn. As long as it's during the day, yeah. So he's a good infinite source of money. You just get 50 rupees every time. Hey, man. 
<laughs> it's a good way of cheesing the uh, the system early on. Until you get light arrows, then money is pointless. Yoink. Alright, full wallet already. So let's go deposit those and then go back to... Uh, I just wanted to show off the My Infinite Money option. Which I do think is the best option for infinite money in the game. And then head to the swamp. That music is dangerous, man. Uh, uh, that way. I was going the right way. Yeah. Only reason I'm depositing the money is because I can't collect more money. Because it's full. So I might as well. It's 200 rupees I don't have to uh, get later for stuff I need. I think the all night mask costs like 500 rupees or something. Something like that. Oh, I remember you because of the stamp. She's lying every time she says she remembers me, by the way. Or at least the first time she ever says it, she's lying. <laughs> the jazz hands. All right. We're going to the swamp. Ow. Fuck. Now I look like a fool. Like a damn fool. Nope, nope, nope. Shit. I didn't want to talk to you. <laughs> Alright, yeah, the Virgin Society. I got it. Cool. Now, luckily, the one guard told all the other guards, Don't worry, this kid, there's a kid with this sword. He's cool. You can let him through. Because they never question you once you run into one guard. Alright, you're gonna want to get out of my way. Got no bombs? Damn. God, it's so much easier to uh, farm this field for items when you're a Goron. Oof, I missed that already. Isn't there something on top of that? Maybe. Hmm. No, I don't think there is. Like they put a flower there as a fakey. Oh, I forgot. Like it shows that Skull Kid was, you know, he's a person. You know, he just wanted friends. I mean, yes, he's doing fucked up things. Oh, I remember this. Tail and I drew this uh, with the Skull Kid when we first met him. He told us that he had been fighting with his friends and that they had left him all alone. You mean his ancient godlike friends? <laughs> yeah, in the manga, like, Skull Kid's way older than he looks. He's like thousands of years old. Let's take shelter in that log. I'm sure there's nobody else sharing that log. Ooh. Man, I hate the rain. Yeah, I know. Me too. Being a ball of light, you know, the rain is not kind to people like us. Let's hug. Okay. Oh, Poor Skull Kid. Like, he's not bad. Like, the mask is the one making him do it. Oh. Now I've got two of you. <laughs> yes. We are all good friends. Best friends forever. <laughs> we do flips and stuff. I play music while you stand there and listen. I sneak up on you in the grass. <laughs> yes, this will make a good montage one day. <laughs> Good thing I found this chalk. Oh. <laughs> no, it's an interesting lesson. Like, you never sure you you never really know what other people are going through. So you know, show him a little sympathy. I'm sure it was because he was always playing tricks and nobody wanted to play with him. But to do what he just did, uh, like he fucking just killed everybody before we reround re time. Oh, and then he also mugged the 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 creepo pedo man. And he found Majora's mask. Oh, and it whispered to him. And once he got his power... Oof. 
never a good sign when when masks start whispering to you, I'm just gonna say. Or weapons. Ooh. Puts a lot of things into uh, perspective. Okay, so once I get to the swamp's hut. Swamp's hut. The witch's hut. I think I'm gonna take like five minutes to go make a Sammy. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, they're bats. Keys. Which look different than like all forms of keys. Alright. Shit. I don't think there's anything good down that hole. Uh, heh. <laughs> now let's find out. Well, I could always use more nuts and sticks. Da 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 da! You found a stick! You killed a living thing and you got a stick. It's crazy. Also, those holes are a great spot for fish. Ooh! I did need that. I actually need money right now. Because I want to buy whatever map Tingle is selling. Ooh, but I don't know if a bubble can reach Tingle right now. No, I think he's too high for that. I have to wait until I get the bow. Well, maybe not. Let's find out. Damn it. Way too high. It's not the easiest thing in the world aiming this thing. Hey, I can reach. Oh my god! Ah! What was his voice? I gave him like a lisp, right? What's this? Green clothes! White fairy! You're a fairy! My name's Tingle! Ah, uh, 35! I don't uh, He told me all this before. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky! Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Yeah, I'd like to buy a map for a snowfall, uh, for Woodfall, please. Yippee! Thank you. Don't call again, Tingle, Tingle! Kululimpa! Those are my magic words. Copyright! Patent pending! Uh. Ooh. The witch's hut isn't that way, is it? Uh, I don't think it is. I think that's the shooting gallery. Which I need a bow and arrow for. It's actually a fun shooting gallery. Ooh. Oh, I should have gotten the title deed just so I could get that heart piece. Yeah, I'll get it later. Important to remember that frog. There's a fairy in uh, this thing. In one of these. Ooh, can't wait till I have the song of soaring. Then, then the game gets a little bit more, like, a little easier given the fact that you have to constantly like rewind time. Ooh, can I get the camera yet? You need the camera. Let's see, I can't talk to you right now because I don't have the title deed. I mean, I can talk to you, but he wouldn't help me. Uh, hey, can I have the camera? Blimey! Where is he? That spoiled troiled is off playing hooky again. His child, by the way, is, um, Tingle. A lot of people don't know that. Uh, a child his age has no business searching for fairies. Well, okay, maybe a lot of people do know it. <laughs> he just says it. Oh! Um, welcome. Oh, but well then, why don't you show me the pictograph you've taken? Uh, I don't have a pictograph. Huh? Is this your first time entering the pictograph contest? Well, the Swamp Tourist Center is currently holding a pictograph contest. It's open to all ages, from children to adults. For nice pictographs taken in the swamp, a free boat cruise will be awarded as a free special prize. Would you like to enter? I have to take the boat cruise first. Alright, and I don't think I can take the boat cruise because... Yeah, she's currently unconscious. I just want the camera. Alright. I mainly want the camera. Uh, she's... That way. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you. Uh, I will... I, in the future, I'll need magic beans. Right now, I don't need magic beans. I made it. Okay. 
You gotta be careful with the bounces. They're not easy to control. I think this is the witch's hut. Let's see. Magic Hags Potion Shop. Same thing. Oh, did I did I take too long? Shit, did I have to come here on the first day? She's looking for her um Shit, I think I needed to come here on the first day. Well, that's unfortunate. Um Easy fix though. Just means I have to warp back in time. <laughs> uh, cuz she's not supposed to leave. She's not supposed to leave yet. Okay. <laughs> okay. Probably should have just started the cycle over once I got the uh, the bomb bag. Yes. All right. So once I travel back in time, then I'll take a five minute break to make a Sammy. I'm hungry and it's it's food time. Right now and then two hours from now it's food time. I like to have a consistent time where I do certain things. Just makes it easier. It's complicated. <laughs> There's a reason for it, but it's, it's complicated. <laughs> Alright. Well, that was unexpected. Let's slow down time. Always a good thing to do right out of the gate if you aren't specifically trying to get to a certain time. Just slow down time immediately. And there's no point in me making a new song with the Scarecrow right now because um, I don't have the hook shot. Yeah. Okay. So, I'll let you listen to the music. Uh, I will BRB. Yeah, where can I lay you? Right there. Oh, please don't fall. Ooh.
this fucking good evening. Oh, burp. Okay. Uh, probably realized while I was making my Sammy, I probably should have paused because uh, time's moving forward. Granted, it's moving forward very slowly, but it is moving forward. Okay. All right, adorable dog. That reminds me of something very sad. Uh, get out of my way. Hey, you don't remember me? I'm the guy. Stop right there. Have you some errand in the swamp? It's dangerous outside the town walls, so I cannot allow a child like you to... Wait, you have a sword? Go right ahead, sir. Kill everything you need to kill. Do what must be done. Man, Palpatine was right. <laughs> he had a point. Alright, luckily I wasn't too far into the swamp, so... You know, I can go fast. Oh, I just remember... Uh, did that, does that treasure chest respawn with the hundred rupees? That's always a good thing to get every time, just because it's a free hundred rupees. So, like, why not? Oh well. I'm already too far away. I don't want to go back. <laughs> Never going back. Oh, travel gets better with one of two things. Either you get the Goron Mask, or you get the Bunny Hood. Both of those make travel a little bit better. Not counting, of course, fast travel. Which makes everything better. Did Ocarina of Time have fast travel? It did, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. You could travel to the the temples, like the Nocturne of Shadow, like like lets you time, like lets you teleport. Right. Couldn't remember. Like. Did it have fast travel? Or was that before fast travel was a thing in games? It's It's been a lot longer since I played Ocarina than uh, Majora's Mask. Like, Majora's Mask is a game I try to hit up on a semi-regular basis. Like, it's a game I thoroughly enjoy and love. 
it, to me, it just has more replay value. Even if Ocarina of Time is more iconic, and I won't argue the counterpoint on that, like, it is a more iconic game. The story is a bit more timeless. You know, no pun intended. Um... I think I have to talk to her first. I think I've made this mistake in the past. Talk to her first, then find the witch, then come back and talk to her again. <laughs> One of the bad guys from the first Ocarina of Time, but in this universe, she's actually just a, a decent old hag. Tee hee hee! Welcome! My potions work very well, they do. Speak to the hag. <laughs> Hmm, if only I had some fragrant mushrooms. I don't have that. I don't have the pig mask. Long ago, this powerful nose of mine could detect them wherever they grew. But lately, my nose has lost its touch. It's tough getting old. It's tough, I tell you. Yeah, I hear you. It is tough getting old. What does she give you if you get the mushrooms? Is it the blue potion? Ooh, I think it's the blue potion, but I'm not 100% sure. Time for monkeys. Hmm, follow me! Uh, Link is very un unfazed by the fact that a monkey is talking. Oh, I hate the way this monkey runs. <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't do another 180. Ow. Fucker. Hang on. If I wasn't chasing, I'd fight. <laughs> Help me. I was just minding my own business, picking mushrooms, when BAM! I got punched in the back of the fucking head! That pesky skull kid! Did he think an old hag wouldn't recognize him if he hit his face? Oh, how? How to think he's that powerful that he can punch an old woman? And now I can't even move. He, he must have hit me with stunning strike. It's crazy. You, don't you have anything that gives you energy? I, I have a bomb mask. What the fuck is that gonna do? You're no help. I say, you're not at all what you make yourself out to be. I don't make myself out to be anything but a guy. Just trying to make my way through this life. Trying to do the right thing in a world where it's far too easy to do your wrong. No, wait, no, that's not right. Trying to, <laughs> that's not right. I'm just a guy trying to make my way in this world, trying to do his best in a world where it's far too easy to do your worst. <laughs> that's the line I wanted. I fucked that up. Give me the heart. Yeah. It's probably a red flag that they have a human heart in a jar out here, but you know, you know, desperate times. Oh, I messed up that line. I'm really upset about it. <laughs> Fuck. I'm just a guy trying to make his way through this world, doing his best in a world where it's far too easy to do your worst. No. Tee hee hee. Welcome. Um, how are you doing? Wait, 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 wait. What? My sister? A skull Kid killed Comb? Oh, does that mean I get her inheritance? Ooh. Wait, you're saying she's not dead? That's ridiculous. If it's just the Skull Kid, then what harm could he possibly do? Oh, well if that's true, then take this potion to her. This isn't good. You got a bottle! Quick, take that potion to her now! Alright. I'm on it, hag. Don't call me that, I have a name! That's so rude! I've been nothing but decent to you! It's not like I tried to kill you in another universe that I don't know about because that's not me. Yeah, that's right, bitch. God, if this were Breath of the Wild, my brain just went to like, oh my my shield durability. <laughs> this is not Breath of the Wild. There is no such thing as shield durability in this game. Oh, whoops. Right! 
There is no analog. There's no dual analog in this game. I gotta stop doing that. I made this. I made the right analog stick my C stick. Now, I don't you feel obligated to help me, you little fuck? Um, I'm I'm not sure if I want to help you anymore. You you were just really really rude to me. But I'm going to not because I want to, but because it's the right thing to do. Ah, that color, that smell, that's definitely Kotake's. Hey, give me that. Give me that. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, she's just licking the bottle all over. Oh, yeah. Oh, feel the energy flow. Comb is revived. Yeah. Oh, you saved me. Don't think I'll forget that. I'm the boat, I'm the swamp tour guide. I run the boat cruise, so come by if you want a free ride. A young man. <laughs> I'm not evil, I swear. Yeah, cool beans. <laughs> and I'm being attacked by monkeys. <laughs> you have strange powers, no? You can understand us. Me been watching you. Hmm. <laughs> Lately, this swamp, filled with poison water. Temple above waterfall, strange. Brother go to temple, but no brother. But but brother no able to find temple entrance. Temple for Deku only. Brother captured by Deku, now in palace. Help. <laughs> I'm on it, Deku. It's been a long road. Well, we're gonna save your brother. <laughs> you can just shoot that Octorok later if you just have a bow and arrow. Mm. I hope I don't have to pay for the boat ride. I saved her life. She should pay for it. In theory. All right. Oh, it's you. Well, I guess I won't kill you. Thanks for what you did back there. In a special deal just for you. I'll let you take this cruise for free. Ah, oh, yes, we've got a special going on right now, so we're giving this out for free. Pictograph. Oh, yeah. If you take a nice picture from the boat, take it to that fella over there. All right, the boat's leaving. Welcome to the boat cruise. Please set your pictograph box to see. Enjoy the swamp scenery to your heart's content. All right, I'm actually not going to waste my time taking a picture of anything. Because I already know what I need to take a picture of. Because <laughs> there's one of two things you can take a picture of in order to get the heart piece from the pictograph guy. You either take a picture of the Deku King... Or you take a picture of Tingle. And he's just so worried that you're going to tell people that Tingle's his son. That he just, like, gives you a heart piece. And he's just like, please don't tell anybody. Oh, I was just minding my business. Very nice. Now, now arriving at Deku Palace. This swamp water is poisonous here, so please watch your step or you'll die. Are you disembarking? Oh, come on. I'm gonna talk to you. Get the fuck back here. Ooga, 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 chaka. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can do that all day. I can do this all day. Hmm. Do I have to go in there right now? I'm trying to remember. Or do I? Do I just immediately sneak in from the side? Eh, let's go in. This is the palace of the Deku Kingdom. Only those on official business may enter. 
Yes, I've had too much coffee this morning. Look at my face. Look at my face. But you might enter to see the public humiliation of the foolish monkey who angered our king. We're going to cut his head off. Actually, we're going to burn him alive, but then we're going to cut his head off after the fact. It may seem excessive, but we're doing it for a reason. Do not enter any other areas whatsoever. I mean, what's stopping me? What's stopping me? Tell me right now. Nothing. What a thought. Uh, too low. Nope. 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 That's not what I meant to do. Uh, no. Ooh. Man. The emulator does not like the pictograph. Oh, I thought the game crashed. I'm like, I haven't save stated since this day started. <laughs> uh oh. Trying to get a good picture. That's a good picture. Now it's got to wait a minute for it to process. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll keep that picture. Nobody questioned the fact that I'm just taking pictures. I haven't seen your face before. Are you visiting? Usually I don't allow the likes of you riffraff in my royal chamber. But today is different. Today I'm in the mood to dance. We're about to kill that motherfucker that just kidnapped my daughter. He has insulted the royal family. I'll show him what happens when you do that. <laughs> Look at that dance. I like this guy. Now that our beloved princess is missing, the king has been unable to keep his cool. I fear the princess may be caught up in some kind of trouble, just as that monkey claims. But in his current state, the king can't even send troops out to look for her. What are we to do? I don't know. Not this. Ooga, 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 chaka. Ooga, 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 chaka. Ooga, 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 chaka. Alright. ba 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 was my brother all right? Did you see Endurance Duke Cage? We know Secret Route there. Enter Secret Route through uh, from Outer Garden Entrance, but Entrance in Tall Place, no can reach it. Need Bean from Bean Cellar, live beneath Palace Garden. Hmm, understand my meaning? I do. Oh, you smart. Plant Bean in Soft Place by Outer Garden. You figure out rest, hurry, help brother. I will roger that. Now I'm getting used to the uh, N64 controls again. This game does hold up pretty well in spite of the outdated control scheme. Like the visuals, I actually think the visuals are fine. <laughs> They're not bad at all. Give me your ball or your nut, whatever. The hole's over here, right? Oh, is the bean cellar on the other side? Damn it, I thought the bean cellar was over here. All right. Uh-oh. <laughs> What's this Deku doing? I don't know, he's just kind of swinging all over our palace. It's like he's scouting us. Should we, should we just arrest him? Yeah, we good. Should we? Yeah, let's do it. Hey, Deku, get back here. We're arresting you. Shit, we can't go that way. Where's the bean cellar? Oh, I remember where the bean cellar is. Son of a bitch. All right. All right, that's fair, that's fair. <laughs> What's up? Get out of my way. I'm going back in to watch the monkey suffer. Get out of my way. Uh, I think it's this one. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. Oop, nope, I'll never make that. Ooh, yeah, okay, I need money. Please.
turn around. Don't do it. Don't do it. That's what I thought. Fuck a walk. Shit. <laughs> I'm gonna get in the hole. Alright. Any hidden rupees? I mean, they're not hidden. There we go. 42! That's the answer. Oh, I need water, don't I? Good thing I remembered. That would have been, uh, silly. Just so I don't accidentally pour the water on the ground. I don't think this bean sprout leads anywhere. I think this is just... It leads up there. I don't think there's anything worth getting. Shit. I don't remember. Maybe I'll buy two beans so I can test it. Well, chomp chomp, you're the first customer I've had in a long time. You need any magic beans? These things are the fucking tits, man. You sprout water on them and they grow and let you fly. Here's one for free. I mean, it's cool, right? Uh, you can plant them wherever you want. You want to buy one, though? Uh, yeah, yeah, here, 10 rupees per bean, man. I'm, I'm never gonna stop eating for the rest of existence. Ah, magic beans. Alright, I... Nope, no, apparently I'm too far away, son of a bitch. Mmm. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Much easier in this game than in Ocarina of Time. In Ocarina of Time, you actually need to time travel so that it has time to grow. Alright, let's see if whatever's in there was worth it. If it's a heart piece, it was worth it. It was not a heart piece. I mean, okay. That buys me more beans. So that's, I mean, it wasn't not worth it. Okay, apparently I can't jump that. I'm going to kill you! Hey. Ah, an intruder! Should we string him up with the monkey? Nah, just toss this one on his ass. <laughs> Wait, did that kid just turn into a Deku? Am I seeing shit? <laughs> Alright. Hang on, I gotta go left. For reasons. He turned around real fast, okay. <laughs> Ow, stop, fuck. Okay, we're only gonna throw you out like six more times. We're, we're not giving you that many more warnings, dude. Stop veering off course. Did he just veer off course? He immediately veered off course. That son of a bitch. Oh, he turned around so fast. Okay, I have, I have my chance. Now. Eh. Stop running. Why did I stop running? Right, hopefully he doesn't look to the right. Good thing they can't hear footsteps. Oh, I want that money. Uh, it's five rupees. I don't need it, but I want it. Alright, got it. The one reason I went back in there for the piece of heart. Hey! I'm lost! Can you help me find my parents? Get out of here, asshole! Oh. Mm. They're just looking at me like this fucking guy. This fucking guy. <laughs> All right. 
Plant the seed. Watch it grow. Oh, damn it. I didn't refill on water. No. No. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Fuck. I tested the... I used the water on the free sample. Shit, is that seed going to despawn when I leave? I might need to buy another seed while I'm in there. Fuck. Not that it was hard to get there, but like, fuck, I'm just annoyed at myself. All right, I need to get back in one more time. Get out of my way. I might as well be royalty to you. And straight to the right. <sighs> Wasn't fast enough. Mm. Son of a bitch. I had the damn water. And I used it on the test. Damn it. And then I forgot to get more damn water. Mmm. Such a stupid reason to have to go back. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm so impatient now. Oh, it's my own fault. All right, we're only gonna throw you out like 20 more times. So, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna stop telling you here pretty soon. Stop veering off course. We're watching you, that motherfucker. the money doesn't respawn. Turn! 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 Motherfucker. Motherfucker. There's no other good source of water out here. Just in case, I'm gonna buy another bean. Because I don't know if that bean I just planted will despawn. Because I left the area without growing it. Alright. Oh no! <laughs> oh, 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 fuck. Wow, that, that Deku. That Deku can take a punch. That guy. That fucking guy. I like his shorts. Hey, good, I didn't need to buy it. So I, good, I wasted money, yay. Money's meaningless in this game, so whatever. Kill him. You don't really need to. I mean, unless he shoots you midair, which is actually not the easiest thing in the world for him to do. Easy as pie. They know I'm here, and they aren't sounding the alarm. They're the worst guards ever. Mm, this one might kill me. <laughs> Maybe I should kill this one. Nah. Uh oh. It's going the other way. Oh, I made it. Oh. Don't shoot me. Don't do it. 
Oh, yeah. Where am I going? Is that it? Does this go up? Are we not going to talk about the magic, magic floating platforms? How did the Deku have the power to do this? They keep saying that I kidnapped her. No matter how many times they say it, I'm not, it's not gonna bring the princess back. If they're not careful, the princess will fall victim to a monster. Why won't they believe what I say? Fine, I get it. Then I shall say nothing more to you. Punish me or do whatever else you might. All right, I think he cares that I'm not a human. Yo, you, how did you get here? Shh, if they see you, they'll capture you. What? My brothers asked for your help. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. They're, they're such a pain in the ass. Just try to cut my rope. We'll talk after that. Uh. It's a little high for me, but. Can you just teach me a song? What are you doing? Quick, cut this rope! Oh, no good after all. Oh, I'm gonna die here. Oh, fuck. This is what existential dread feels like? Wait. You don't happen to have something that can make a lot of noise with a loud instrument uh, like, uh, like that carries a long way. If you have one, show it to me. I think he wants it to be the Deku. Oh, you have them! You do! You, uh, I'm not even gonna ask how you just transformed into a Deku. Uh, just like the princess though, Deku pipes! Those will work great! By the way, who are you? <laughs> Whoa, that's not important now. Listen, just listen to me. I was trying to find out about the poison in the swamp, so I went to the Woodfall Temple above the waterfall. But the temple had become a monster's lair, and the princess was captured by the monster. Since the Deku King thinks I kidnapped the princess, he won't listen to a word I say. Now the princess is in trouble, so I must somehow hurry to the temple and save her. Please, I don't want to burn alive. Do you understand my fucking plight? I do. Yeah, so then that means, that means you will go in my place and save the princess. Okay, now I'll teach you the melody that opens the temple. The princess taught it to me. We can't let them hear us, so I'll sing it real softly. Open your ears and listen hard. Up left, up left. A right, A. They're just watching this go down, and they're not saying anything. <laughs> Did that Deku just break into our holding cell? Should we stop him? Nah, let's just watch. You learned the Sonata of Awakening. This melody awakens those who have fallen into a deep sleep. Everyone, did you hear that? This melody, which only the Deku royal family knows. It proves the foolish monkey deceived the princess so he could enter the temple. Everyone, let the monkey's punishment commence. Burn him fucking alive. <laughs> ah, you better, you better take the shortcut to Deku, to, to, to the, the Deku people used to get to the Woodfall Temple, please. You must hurry. If you don't, I will be punished by the Deku. <laughs> I don't want to die. Not like this. Not like this. Come on, bud. Damn it, motherfucker! Son of a. <laughs> I'm coming, buddy. Mm. Oh, I do remember this area. Those things that are flying right above me are the biggest pain in the ass, like ever. Without the bow, they're fucking annoying as shit. Alright, the other one's probably gonna knock me on my ass. Oh, he didn't. Okay, good. 
Oh, wow. That worked. Normally, it's a lot harder to deal with those bastards when you don't have, like, good weapons. Last time I played this game, I remember those guys, like, just knocking me off out of the air, like, a dozen times over. It was annoying. Hey, there's, uh, there's my buddy. Oh, what's his name? Oh, fuck, I don't remember his name. He's the owl. Uh, he has a name, though. I can't think of it off the top of my head. Ooh, hoot! This is a rare sight. You are a fairy child, correct? Did you know a version of me in another universe, maybe? What business might you have in this poison swamp? If you dare not venture further, I shall pass no judgment. It is better that you hurry back to town. This swamp you are in has lost its guardian deity, but it was destined to fade anyway. <laughs> and that destiny is not solely limited to this swamp. If you have the courage and determination to proceed in the face of destiny, then I shall teach you something useful before coming here. Had you not seen any of the stone statues that bear close resemblance to me? I have placed those throughout the land to aid the one with the power to change the destiny of this land. His eyes are so bored, like, alright, I'm, I'm here to, to lead you on your destiny or whatever. Wherever he may appear, if you have left proof of our encounter on any of those stone statues, then the song carved at my feet will certainly be of some assistance. Remember it well and play it wherever the need arises. From the first time you play this song, we shall become eternal friends, transist transcending time and space. I was going to say transisting. That's something different. Later, bud. I cannot think of his name. I know it. Mm. Notes are carved in the stone. Yeah. Down right left, down right up, down left up, down left up. Learn directions. <laughs> oh yeah. Fast travel. Yeah, see, Majora's Mask is a great example of how you can make an incredibly different experience while reusing a huge chunk of assets. This melody swoops you up and sends you soaring to a bird. <laughs> oh yeah, but we're not going to force it on you right now. Because that would be super inconvenient. But we'll force it on you down the road. Actually, I don't think they ever did. Oh yeah. wonder if I'll actually be able to get the first temple out of the way today. I'd love to get the bow. That's a, that's an item that just saves you a lot of, like, lets you do a lot of stuff and saves you some trouble. Nope, oh, whoops. Alright. I have to kill you. You guys are a pain in the ass. Haha, <laughs> with my spit. Shoot me. Oh, why am I... Okay, I could have just rolled into you. That works too, though. Alright. Don't end up in the poison water. And we should be good. Yeah, I just murdered one of my own kind. <laughs> That's right, you all saw it. You saw what I was willing to do. All for a flower. I'll murder the flower, too. <laughs> Isn't this the Deku scrub mark? I wonder if they worshipped here. Hint, hint. Well, first things first. Yeah. Ooh, have the bottle ready. Uh, it's one of these. Gotcha. Your freedom is over. You caught a fairy in a bottle. Your new friend will give you life energy the moment you completely run out when you shove it down your throat. As it's screaming, begging for life, you'll feel reinvigorated. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right. 
Just so I don't accidentally use it. Alright, I can get those chests later. Priorities. Uh, I think I remember the song off the top of my head. Up left, up left, A right, A right, or is it... Hmm. A right, A. Okay. Up left, up left, A right, A. Oh, I'd be shitting myself if I were Father Link. <laughs> like, the poison swamp's coming up. It's coming up. <laughs> Guys. Yeez. This is crazy, man. Crazy, man. Right, let's get in there before the fucking... Dawn sends me hurtling into the, the poison. Not the dawn, but the night of the first day. Okay. And... Dang it. I don't think any of those wolves are in this game. They're, they're in the Ocarina of Time. Pretty cool enemy, actually. The Woodfall Temple. Oh, I see you. Don't think I don't see you. I have something just for you. Get over here. You damn right. Alright, I know there's a fairy in one of those beehives. But I need the bone arrow for that. So, that sucks. Oh, another fairy! Well, I only have one bottle. So, nothing I can do about that. Yeah, I know there's a fairy in... I, I, I think it's that beehive. It might be in another room. There's a fairy in that chest. I remember that. But I know those uh, beehives hold some secret fairies somewhere in this temple. Thank you. Second stray fairy. I, mean, I, could, I could try to shoot it with my with my spit. <laughs> that was just a rupee. Okay. Don't hit. Urgh, don't hit a spider. Okay. Not a fan. Oh, there they are. Mm. Alright. Ah, there are no fairies in this room. Okay, sweet. I remember this room. If you've got a fire arrow, you can just solve it. It's like such a, such a thing. Ow. Fuck. Wish the camera would rotate with the right stick. Hmm. Hmm. Bow and arrow would make it real easy to get that fairy. Hmm. I know there's a fairy over there also. But I don't... Yeah, I think I have to clear the water first. Because otherwise I'm stuck down there. I need a key to open this first door. Oh, I take more than one hit. Damn. There's another fairy. Alright. Well, if I'm going down there anyway, then I might as well get the fourth fairy. Right. That's way easier as a Deku. Whee! Oh, I thought that was it. You freed me! Oh, ah, there is a door. Okay. See that? Ooh, almost died for a rupee. Alright, I know I need the bow and arrow to get the thing up top. But for right now, I'm sure that that's a key. Well, maybe. Might be a compass. Or a map. I think the, um, the key might be in that room in front of me. Oh, there we go. It's a key! And while I'm here. Nope. Shit. Try that. Oh, 
I got your, you got your fifth fairy. But it only cost you dying in poison. No, I think that's the only fairy in here. Let me see. I don't think there's another one in here. Nope. You guys are gonna come after me? Right, I guess I gotta get you to chase me. Aflac. Shit. Get in the flower! Dead. Now you're dead. Like a boss. Now, if only I had Cryonis to create a pillar of ice right in the middle there. Oh, that'd be so cool. Is there a fairy in this room? Oh, it's so adorable that he jumps all the way in the treasure chest. I love it. You got the map! Look at the map to find the stuff. What's on the map? Is there a fairy in here? No. Okay. I know some of the mini boss rooms in these games have uh, just fairies like on the ceiling. The water temple has some. <laughs> nope, don't do that. I don't need that flower. I don't need no stinking flowers. Alright, hopefully those flowers don't close and kill me. Neat. Yeah. Yeah, you dead. That's what you get for being a dickhead. Alright, I think I need the bow and arrow for the fairy underneath that rock. This looks pretty light. Well, they just stand there and fucking move it. You know, I like to move it, move it. I dig the background noise. It's like very ritualistic. Yeah. Man, in real life... I would shit myself if I saw that. I'd be done. <laughs> I am not a spider guy. <laughs> Ooh. I'm really, really not a spider guy. All right, there's a couple of fairies in here, but I don't think I can get like any of them as I currently am. Dude, the poison water would kill me right now. Uh, and I'm not sure if I have enough range to get the one up top. I don't think I need the... I don't think I need the ocarina for most of this, if not any of this temple. <laughs> you have made fire! Alright, what do we got? Oh, you assholes! Ah! Oh, clever girl! Side. Come and get me. Uh oh. oh I'm scared. Are you doing this? Oh, alright. <laughs> wow, I remember them being harder. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. I really remember them being way more dangerous. Hmm. It's funny how the memory works. Now you can find the stuff. Not that you really need it. Hmm. Alright, up. Hold 
I probably need the, the fire for something up here. Let's see. Yep. Oh, there's the thing. Uh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, boop. Damn. Damn. I might need to come back in here with the bow and arrow. Alright. Get over here! Any day now. Please. There you go. I don't think the other one has anything but bees. That's a bee! That's a bee! And it'll kill me. Well, I mean, it'll try. I just killed your parents! Think I won't kill you. Oh shit. Fuck. Just killed myself. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck! I keep, ah, uh, the thing that almost got me right there was, um, um, I keep using the right analog stick to turn, and it, I didn't turn because there is no right analog stick movement. So I kind of fucked myself there. Hopefully I find some hearts. Oh, damn it, I have that backwards. <laughs> yeah. It is a hard thing to remember. Alright, no right analog stick, no right analog stick, no right analog stick. This was a different time. Ow! Fucking cunts. Alright. Can I look straight ahead, please? No? Alright, cool. Why, why would the game give us the option to look straight ahead? It's ridiculous. It's, it's crazy. Who needs that? There better be some hearts somewhere. Shit! I'm getting my ass kicked and fuck. I mean, I have a fairy, but like, I don't want to use it. Thank you. Thank you. God, it's the control scheme that's killing me more than anything else. Again, it's not terrible. It's just like easy to forget such simple things. Be careful, I sense a lot of evil here. Em uh, that, that's just me. I know there's more. You have to kill it all. Where? Oh, that'll do it. Oh, right, yeah. You can just do this, you can proc the spin if you time it right. Anyone else? There you go. I think it's a fairy. Oh, you can't open it from behind. Another thing Breath of the Wild did really well. Eight fairies. One, two, three. Yeah. Is there anything up here? Nope, just the torch. Okay. Alright. God, I wish I had the bow and arrow. Nope, that wasn't what I meant to do. Any fairies in here? No. Okay, good. Please. Thank you. Hopefully that turns around. It didn't turn around! Oh, now it turned around. Shit, I could have made it.
please, please. Oh no! Ah! No! 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 <laughs> Stay away from me! God! 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 Okay. <laughs> okay. Before I accidentally fall, push that button. Create magic ladders. Is she gonna tell me to push the button? Was that what you were gonna tell me there? Cute. Very cute. When did I get back up to four hearts? Thought I was still at one and a half. Neat. Eh. Eh. Alright, I know I need to set the fire there. But I can't do that just yet. Is that locked? Yeah, it's locked. Okay. Hmm. No, I'm digging the, the little chanting in the background. It's very primal. <laughs> I respect it. I haven't, uh, I haven't save stated in a while. It's always good to do it every so often because you never know when the game's just gonna crash. A Lizalfos! I'm the Lizalfos Bane in the future. Hey, I had my shield up. What the fuck? Ah, midair. All right, you dead. <laughs> the Lazalfos evolution is impressive. That was a fun fight. I made it harder than I should have because I just I wanted to be bouncy. I could have just taken him out, but I wanted to be bouncy. Uh, no fairies in here. No, oh, I know what this is. You got the hero's bow. Oh, which is funny, because this is a monumental item in this game, but in Breath of the Wild, just, it's just another piece of trash. <laughs> All right, great item though. Like, literally makes the game. Well, I mean, in part. So now I don't have to have those sticks on. Alright, I don't remember what to aim for. It's probably like right above the center number. Not too high. Right there. Okay. Got it. Sweet. I'll take those hearts, please. Thank you. <laughs> No! No! Come back! Shit. Thought I'd just be faster to land on it. Fuck. Okay. My effort to save time has ended up costing three times as much time. So, <laughs> let's just do it the proper way. My effort to save ten seconds cost me like a minute right there. Which is a metaphor for, like, for patience. No, not a metaphor, that's not right. Um, it's like a parable for patience. Like a good lesson that people need to be more patient. Hello. Oh, I have to be a human to damage you, aren't I? Suck. I know, right? Long as you're not riding a turtle, I'm fine. Turtle! I'm a turtle. <laughs> Shit, I gave him the idea. Fuck. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. You can only damage him once. <laughs> A little overzealous. Good thing he won't learn from his mistakes too soon. <laughs> too soon. Fuck. And you can't see him coming. It actually is kind of a pain in the ass. The controls are not, like, fast enough. Got you. Shot you with the spine. And then the turtle died. That means that they were linked. Go, go, go. Croak, croak, Dongero, help me. Go, go, croak, 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 Dongero. Croak, croak. Uh, well, I can't talk to you right now because I don't have your mask. I'll be back for you, buddy. Dongero. Dongero, please. Please, we need to have the performance. Or our lives can never be complete. Oh. Ba -da -ba -ba. Hey, Ganon. Oh, no, this isn't Ganon's game. Never mind. Hey, hey, Majora. How about we don't have keys inside of the temples that lead people through the temples? And then maybe they won't be able to stop you. You might have a point. You might just have a point there. This will be faster. D wrong button. Right, this is not Breath of the Wild. You can't just mash the button to jump faster on a ladder. They hadn't invented that yet. Oh, are you gonna give me some kind of magic solution idea? Well. You could try nope, that didn't work. Nope. Nope. No, I guess you have to look. You can't just Z target. Good to know. Right there. No? There. Right there, no? Too hot. What? What? That was way too high! Alright. <laughs> the hitbox is strange on the Nintendo 64. Oh, yeah. Alright, how do I... I don't remember how I get over... Oh, no, no, I remember how to get over there. Okay, but I need to set it on fire first. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. That was way too high and way too soon. Let's try this. Okay. I'm way overzealous on my on my shooting. I might just mash the button when I get close. I don't think I can shoot fast enough. Damn, how did that not make it? take a minute, but it'll be more efficient. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> it's not the way I prefer to do it, but it's a way that works. It's not what I meant to do. There we go. Oh, I need to backtrack to one other room real quick. So I can get the fairy in there. How many are there per temple? My 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 brain movies seem to indicate to myself like 15. Sounds right. Oof. Oh, it's been a minute. 
15 sounds right. Please. There we go. <laughs> Please. You found me! Yeah, they're Kor- they're the uh, descendants of the, the ancestors of the Korok. You found me! No. Alright. Uh, alright. Alright, well I have some bad news for you, sport. I got a bow and arrow. And you're a spider. So, <laughs> goodbye. Well, the water is pure now, so I can actually go in there and not uh, die of poison. My god. Do I have to, like, pop it with a balloon or something? Or with a sword? There we go. My god. That took way longer than it should have. How do I get out of here? There we go. Alright, no other fairies in here. That's a good sign. Nope, nope. Stay away from me. I'm not in the mood for your shit. Alright, I'll take the stick. Hoping to get some magic power. But the stick works too. Just as good. Right, no more in here. I know there's a shitload in here. I mean, you can just see one roasting on an open fire right there. I'm coming for you! Ooh, and for the sake of my own mental sanity, let's see. I need to get closer to shoot you fuckers, maybe. I'll take you out. Because you'll probably knock me on my ass later. Same with you. Same with you. Oh, I got... Wow! Good shooting there, Link. Didn't think I was gonna hit that. That's what. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Other fairies. Let's see, can't I? Hey, oh. 13. I only need two more. Use some more arrows, though. That'll be 14. Come to me, fairy. I'm coming. Oh, look at my cute body. All right. There's still, there's still one fairy in here. Good. So the last fairy is in here. Hey, arrows. That's what I really needed. Uh. All right. We go up. For no reason. <laughs> uh oh. Well, whoopsie daisies. Ah, uh, the Deku cannot jump very far. Good to know. Link's got this. Flower to flower. This is a temple really made just for Deku. <laughs> like, it was not designed for anyone else. Hmm. Killed all the spiders, didn't I? I think I did.
That's where I came in from. Where's this final ferry? It's in here. Oh, it's probably in a pot. No? Goodbye money. Damn. No? Huh. Interesting. Okay, well in any case... Oh, wow, he did not jump. Oh my god, there's no C-stick. Or, or there's no dual analog. That's right. Oh, I'll never get used to that. <laughs> Alright, I'm just looking for fairies. Yeah, I will literally never get used to the lack of uh, dual analog. Where is this final fairy? It's in here. Oh, what the hell? How did I miss that? Alright, well I found the final fairy. That was the only thing holding me back. Yeah. Get over here! You found all the fairies! Take it, take the fairies back to the the fairy hole, whatever it's called, the fairy fountain, and she'll give you a special prize. <laughs> is it what? Is it sex? No, no, it's something else. Is it sex adjacent? No. <laughs> it is not sex related in any way. Why should I do it? Because stuff. I mean, all right, you have me at stuff. I mean. You make a very good argument. Stuff. I think I have to do this from this particular fire flower, right? Or fire flower. I think so. Way too high. Ooh. Ooh, the aiming is a little rough. Gotta go fast! Oh, nope, 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 not gonna make it. Alright, it's a beautiful dream. It's almost the night of the first day. Wouldn't be so bad falling if it didn't take so long to get back up. Jumping from flower to flower to flower to flower. Ugh, gets old. It does get old. Mm. <laughs> I still love it, but it does get a smidge old. Now, I don't think I'd have a shot from the other flower, so I have to shoot it from here, then go to the flower on the left to make it to the flower right there. Okay. Ah! I almost walked off. There we go. There we go. That's how it's done. Uh, You know what? I don't think it's worth 40 rupees. Especially when money really doesn't matter too much in this game. I don't think it's worth 40 rupees to, uh, to waste the time to get those. So, before I go in that room... Make a nice little savey do. Because I do remember that of all the fights in this game, this is the only one that for some reason always gave me trouble. <laughs> like the fish isn't too bad. Um, the mountain one is just, it's rollies. And the giant one is the easiest thing in the world. 
if you got the giant's mask. <laughs> Which I think you have to get the giant's mask. Maybe not. Hmm. But it's so easy when you get it. Like, almost makes it too easy. Oldalwa! That's your name, right? Oldalwa? Odalwa! Wow, my memory for this game is really good. Alright, Tattle, what do you have to say? If you get close to him, you'll be beaten! Do you understand me? Literally, he will beat you to death! Uh, okay. Keep my distance. Do I have bombs? Yes. Hey, man. That's a little far. That's a little far away. Do I have bombs? I have five. That's better than zero. Shit. 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 Can you s Can you stop jumping around? I also stopped running in big giant circles so I could shoot you. Oh, come on. You got to your second phase while I was pulling the bow? I mean, alright. Hey, guys. Ow, fucker. Guys. Wow, he's not letting me do the spin attack. There we go. I'll take those uh, hearts, please. Don't be. Oh, shit. Alright. We doing this? Ah! I'm gonna shoot you. Ah! This fight is not as bad as I remember, actually. Not even a little bit. <laughs> you danced? Ow! Fucker. I have one more arrow, so don't waste it. <laughs> Doing this. Stop dancing. This is a fight. Ow. Good thing I have a fairy. Ow. Much harder without arrows. That's not what I meant. Well, whatever. Give, give me an arrow. You gave me arrows. That's all I wanted. Okay. There. Much easier with arrows. And the finishing move was in his dick. Yes. Yes. I sliced up into his dick. I could not ask for more. That fight was nowhere near as hard as I remembered. That's awesome. I mean, it's a little disappointing, but it's also awesome. All right, Oldalwa, give me your face. You ripped off the face of Oldalwa. You fucking sociopath. You've just freed the innocent spirit that this dark mask had kept imprisoned within the body of evil Oldalwa. I mean, let's not assume he was evil. We don't know his story. Oldalwa. Hopefully those screenshots go somewhere findable. Every time the, the camera slows down a little bit, that's me hitting F3 to screenshots. <laughs> What's that? Is that a giant god? With a big nose? Is that just one big walking nose? Wait, 
Listen, it seems to be saying something in some weird singing language. Could that crying be its way of teaching us some sort of melody? Don't just stand there, idiot. Get your instrument, not your dick. Your, your ocarina, dumbass. Right, down, A, down, right, up. Right, down, A, right, down, right, up. <laughs> Much harder to do without the actual C buttons. <laughs> Because it just doesn't feel as intuitive. I'm having more fun than I'm, I'm having more fun than I. Then it's hard to explain. <laughs> like I'm having so much fun. This game is so nostalgic for me. Dory's talking to whales right now. Uh, help our friend. Call us. That's what it's saying, I think. Call us. Well, what's your number? We got to get those digits, yo. Oh yeah. Oh, I freed a temple on my what? <laughs> it was faster than I expected. Freed a temple. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's time to leave. Job done. There was nothing else we forgot about. No monkeys to save at all. The four people Tail talked about. Do you think he was talking about the spirit that was sealed inside that mask? Oh, hey! You were pretty good out there. You you fought a god. Have you done this before or something? What? It's crazy, man. You didn't even use your fairy. Now, just keep up that pace and save the other three. Hey. Um. Uh. I don't know how to say this. Um. Uh. So I'm not going to say it. Wait, no. Uh. You know, all that stuff I did to you, you know, your horse, kidnapping, you know, trying to murder you, bullying you, pushing you in the ground, forcing transformation upon you. I, um, I don't know, like, if you're gonna fucking cry about it, I guess I'm, like, I apologize. <clears throat> or something. Sorry. Whatever. Can we go? There, I apologize. So don't hold it against me. Got it? Now then, we've helped the princess just like the monkey asked. So now our next stop is in the mountains. Let's hurry and do something about that damn skull kid, man. I'm like bouncing. Scrub it away. Slice. Aw. <laughs> He's cute. What? Who are you? Roscoe? Fucking stupid name. Pleased to meet you. I'm the Deku Princess. My name is the Deku Princess. <laughs> Were you by chance asked to asked by that monkey to come save me? <laughs> ah! Just as I suspected. You see, your body smells a little bit like monkey. <laughs> but I mean, you are a human or Hylian, whatever. So I guess you are a monkey. So the monkey made it back fine after all. That's good. You mammals always have me worried because you all just like bleed and die and stuff. All I need is the sun and some water. I was worried that when I didn't come home, my father would think that monkey had kidnapped me. I was worried that my father would even go so far as to punish the poor monkey, burning him alive and eating his flesh. Ooh, wouldn't that be silly and stupid? Such an overreaction. Don't tell me. Are you serious? Is father actually gonna fucking do that? Oh my God. Oh my God. Ah, ah, ah. Well, we haven't any time to lose! Quickly, Mr. Roscoe! Could you please find something to carry me in so you can take me to the Deku Palace? I don't care if it's illogical and makes no damn sense! Find something to carry me in! Wink, wink! Alright, goodbye, fairy. Nice having you while I had you. 
Get in the bottle! That makes no sense. You put the Deku Princess in a bottle. It's a tight fit, but she but she says she'll be fine if you hurry. Ah, uh, Mr. Roscoe! Ah, uh, there's no time to lose! Hurry, please take me to the palace! Please! It hurts in here! Oh! Oh, my body doesn't feel right in here! Oh my god! This is agony! Alright, before I do that... Uh... Where is... Oh, that music is so classic, Zelda. Where's the fairy fountain? It's in here. Oh, that, you know, that, that music is pure Zelda at its, like, finest. I think that was the theme that was, uh, I mean, it, obviously it's the theme from the original, but I think this particular version of it is much more akin to uh, A Link to the Past. Ba -ba 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 -ba. There's... There's the son of a bitch. Well, I want that chest, so let's let's get that chest. Oh, I'm not gonna make it! That's unfortunate. <laughs> it's much further away than it looked. We'll just use Cryonis. Create a platform closer. Oh, right, wrong game. Uh... Let's see if that gets me close enough. It does. Money. Bloopy! Nothing wrong with a good old fashioned bloopy. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, he runs adorably. But very heedlessly. I think I need to be on that flower to get in there. <laughs> Save the princess, yeah. Say a uh, kill Ganon, yeah. It's Zelda. Do 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 Am I the chest burster? Oh my god. How did... How did Nintendo approve that design? It makes no sense knowing Nintendo. Oh, strong young one. I am the great fairy of power. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. As thanks, I grant you prowess with this new sword technique. It's like a super spin attack. Which is really good. Like, it has, like, way more range and, I think, does more damage. Ugh, what, the, what are you doing? Are you Matrix downloading me? Or uploading me? Whatever. Ugh. Oh, I know, I know. Kung Fu! Also, I'm hard! You mastered the spin attack. Your sword will unleash with a whirlwind of energy. Oh, yeah. Come see me again. Come see me again whenever you're overcome by weariness. <laughs> Alright. Totally worth it. Probably the worst of the four Great Fairy Rewards. Because the sword is awesome. Even if it doesn't get used too often, it is a great sword. Um, double hearts and double magic power are real good. <laughs> like, real good. And I think that's the other two rewards. Ooh, heart piece? Usually when a thing does this big, prolonged, grandiose thing, it's a heart piece. It's a heart piece! Sweet. Like, if it's just money, it'll just be like, yeah, here's five bucks. Enjoy. Like, there's no pomp and circumstance. It's just, here's your money. Get out. Rupee! Rupee! 
20 bucks. I think my wallet is pretty close to full. Yeah, it's getting there. All right, so I don't have time to do the skull house here. Um, like, I super don't have time to do the skull house. Also, I don't think I have what I need to do the skull house. Um, I think you need the hook shot. I think. I'm here to save the day. Get out of my way. Oh, whatever you say, Mr. Deku. Ooga, 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 jaga. Uh, Mr. Osgo, why are you waiting? Mr. Osgo, I'm trying to talk to the monkey. I want to see what he has to say right now. Alright. How about that? Hot, isn't it, you fucking monkey? You will suffer! You will burn in the fires of everlasting torment as your flesh is seared from the bone! You shall know the wrath of a king whose darling princess was taken away from him! Squeak! Makes no sense. How does she fit in that bottle? Oh! My princess! My darling princess! You are alright! I was so worried! Oh, foolish father! I'm gonna fucking kill you! I'm gonna kill you! I'm gonna kill you! I'm gonna kill you! Uh, should we stop her? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> what are you doing? Let that monkey go this instant! No! Wow, that, that butler is jerking it. <laughs> Oh, Mr. Monkey! I'm truly sorry! Father does such rash things when he's worried about me! You know, silly fathers! I understand, Princess. Forget about that. I should have done a Caduceus voice with him. I understand, Princess. Forget about that. Has the temple been returned to normal? Why, yes! Thanks to Mr. Roscoe here! I am very, truly grateful! Really? So you're called Roscoe? Are you? Thank you for keeping your promise to me. Yeah. As a symbol of our grat- No. As a symbol of our gratitude, our butler has prepared a little something for you. Please accept it. I'll take the butler gift. You'll find it in the shrine that you will- That will be to your right when you leave the palace. Have a good life. We're, we're probably never going to hear from you again. Hasty decision making is my weakness. This time- more than ever, it has become clear to me. Stop murdering people. I got it. There is little I can do. Please rest a bit before going. Oh, I just realized. You can only do the pictograph contest on the first day, so my picture of the Deku King won't help me today. I'll have to take a picture. I'll have to take his picture again in the future to uh, utilize that. Which is completely fine. So I do remember what the reward is. I think he gives me the pig mask, the butler. Which is good for one thing and one thing alone, and it's, alone, and it's getting the free blue potion. Which is important for a couple of things. Like, I think you need a blue potion uh, to get through the Gibdo maze in Icona Canyon. I think. It's all, like, up here, and it's all, like, loose. But my memory seems to indicate that. Ooh, he, I love him. Roscoe, I am truly thankful for what you have done for the princess. As a sign of our gratitude, we, Deku, have prepared something that we think uh, may assist you. I will lead you to it. Alright, there we go. Please follow me. Alright. I vaguely remember this being difficult. The, the race is actually like more difficult than the dungeon. It's not even a race. He's supposed to just lead me somewhere, and instead he just, like, fucking leaves me behind. I went the wrong way. Made it. Hey! Oh, boy. Oh. Alright, don't touch the fire or you die instantly. I do remember that. Deku don't like fire. Oh, 
So of course they put magic fire all over their uh, their thing. <laughs> oh no! Ah, oh, that that hurts. That hurts. I just start over because I fell. Can I be a human, or do I have to be a Deku when I do this? Because being a human would really help jumping over that part. Deku don't exactly jump well. They're faster, I think, on their feet. But, yeah, they don't uh, handle the jumping part. Particularly, uh, awesomely. <laughs> but I think they're faster on their feet. I think they're more useful in terms of mobility. Like, the Hylian is actually pretty terrible in terms of mobility outside of jumping. Woo! Wait, did he just turn into a human? Are we gonna question that? Nah. Do you want to file the paperwork? I don't want to fill out the paperwork. I'm like I'm like those cops from uh, the uh, the episode of the Book of Boba Fett where they pull over the Mando in his new Naboo starfighter. And they're like, yeah, I don't want to fill out this paperwork. Let him go. It's fine. Like it's it's fine. Uh oh. Nope, nope, nope. Here we go. I'm a coming! Not as fast as you, I can't fly. Oh, where did you go? Oh, I think I went the wrong way. No, I didn't. Okay. Oh! Fuck! I, f I thought it was so simple. I'm like, oh look, it's just right there. No, I forgot there's flames. Oh! <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I remember this being a pain in the dick. Not because it's hard, but because you have to start the whole fucking thing over if you make a single mistake. It's not hard, it's just... One mistake is just costly. And that's annoying because it's so easy to make mistakes. It's not a bad thing. But it's just like, even the butler apologizes. I do remember that. He apologizes when you get there and he's just like, yeah, I, I don't know what I was thinking. Like, I this was a gift and I, I just like, I forced you to go through this. Sorry. <laughs> see those red rupees, but I'm not confident in my ability to make those jumps. So. And I'm so close to being full on rupees that it doesn't matter. Ooh. I'm trying to remember where you get the hook shot, because I definitely want to get a big wallet as soon as I can. Ooh, okay. When I get into that room... Nope, not that way. There we go. When I get into that room, I, uh... I need to turn into a Hylian, so that way fire doesn't just instant one-hit kill me. So that way, even if I make mistakes, whatever. Mistakes happen. Okay. This is like such a cruel little maze. Like, why is he putting me through this? I saved the princess. I mean, I know why he's putting me through this. He misses his son. Ah! Uh, shit. I didn't see where he went. Fuck! <laughs> you bastard!
hope this is the right way. You sick bastard. You sick fuck. What were you thinking? Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? Well done, Roscoe. Now here's the item I promised. Please accept it. You got a pig mask. Yeah, you can literally only use it for one thing. Actually, when I see you, I am reminded of my son who left home long ago. That's the dead guy. That, that, that's the dead tree that you see in the beginning of the game. Somehow I feel as if I am once again racing with my son. I am afraid I may have tried too, uh, too hard to outrun you. As old as I am, I am still a fast competitor, just like when I raced my son. Please forgive my rudeness. <laughs> he apologized, so he, he has my respect. But like, and I get it, he misses his son. In fact, I don't think they ever confirmed this, but I'm, it's something I always assumed. It's worth thinking about. Um, so, the Goron and the Zora, those masks in this game very specifically have, um, connection to actual beings who are now spirits. So, I've always had the theory that because there was a dead Deku so close to where Majora cast the curse on me, that my spirit bonded with, like, the soul of that Deku for a time, and so I am actually the spirit of his son. Or at least, when I'm in this form, I'm the spirit of his son. Which is... a little sad. Sure. It's a smidge... It's a smidge heartbreaking. I don't know. It's kind of awesome. Also. Okay. That feels like a good stopping point. Um... Yeah, that feels like a good stopping point. I got the first dungeon, uh, slash fungeon. I got the bow and arrow. I got a bunch of heart pieces. I got a bunch of masks. What, did I get five masks today? Yeah, I got five masks just casually and right out of the gate, so that's pretty cool. Um, uh, this leads to a bunch of masks. Um, this leads to, I think, a mask. Uh... So yeah, let's see, is there anything else I need to, I got the fairies, so I don't think there's anything I have set up currently. I think I can just rewind time. Which will save my game, and then I'll make a save state also, just in case. Because I'm, I'm not used to uh, playing games particularly on emulators. Uh, it's not that I've never played a game on emulator, but I, I'm usually a console guy. Oh, my money! Eh, whatever. I can get more money. <laughs> I can get more money. That's not a hard thing to get. I should have deposited the money. Didn't occur to me. That was like almost 200 rupees. Again, hardly the end of the world. Okay. So, from there, though, uh, I'm gonna call that personally a successful first part. Uh, yeah, let's just leave it on default. It'll be fine. I'm not gonna play any other games on here. But yeah, um. Oh, oh. <laughs> on that note, though, uh, thanks for watching if you did. Yeah, I, this is one of my favorite games of all time. It's my favorite Zelda game. Uh, and it would probably be on my top five list of all time favorite games. Probably. I have to give that some thought. Zelda is my favorite franchise of all time. But, like, there are some other games, though, that... Ooh, there are some other games out there that are phenomenal in my eyes. Like Mass Effect 2, Subnautica, Terraria. Um, just, there's a bunch of games. Like, I can't even think of a tenth of them off the top of my head. Resident Evil 4, classic and amazing. Anyway, anyway I'm getting off topic. Uh, thanks for watching, if you did. To all of the Roscos who are... Uh, <laughs> going in that direction. Poke. There. It's just a big line of a finger. Um, next time I'll continue on with more Majora's Mask. Uh, like I'll head to the mountains. I'll get some more heart pieces. Now that I have the bow and arrow, uh, options are available to me. Once I get the Mask of Truth. No, not Mask of Truth. Once I get the Lens of Truth. That's what I was thinking. Uh... I know of how I can get a few masks just by having that. So that'll be a big feather in my cap. 
Though I'm trying to remember how to get this the the hook shot. Is that in Zora's domain? Oh, I remember where you get the hook shot. I remember exactly where you get the hook shot. Uh, it's all coming back to me. That's in the Gerudo Fortress. That's um that, or the Pirate Fortress. They don't. I don't think they ever use the word Gerudo in this game. But yeah, that's in the Pirate Fortress. Yeah, the hook shot opens up a huge chunk of the game. So yeah, that's something I definitely want to get. Ooh, next part though, probably the mountains and the Goron stuff, and maybe some more heart pieces. Uh, till then though. Peace. Hopefully I was entertaining to watch. If not, yeah, that sucks, but I had fun. So... <laughs>